Hey everyone, Pam Bam Richard. Welcome to. <laughs> as you can tell, we're a little bit rushed in to get things going here, as uh, there are some things that to sort out prior to uh, starting here. So I apologize for the delay. Um, welcome to Tales of Marathon Stream Three Day Three. There's our proper introduction. Let's get things going with the rest of Tales of Vesperia. And I noticed that the game audio wasn't going. Perfect start. Okay, now let's go. <laughs> Whew. And I realize I'm now going backwards. Good start. You know, we're going to get things warmed up right over here. As we're trying to remember where we left, we last left off last night. I hope everybody's doing okay this morning. Hope everybody's fine and dandy as we keep on moving forward here. Been through a bit of a crazy marathon yesterday because we had to catch up from all the lost time that was kept. But now we're here and let's keep on pushing forward. What about the mayo? Well, <laughs> you're eight years too late for that one. All right, well, we got the Kylan for uh, repeat. We're going to put that on right here. That's going to give us dash cancel and high mobility. Uh, dash cancel is going to be very useful for us, but high mobility, um, you'd think with a name like that, it would like affect like his general mobility, but it's only like an over limit thing. So that's not particularly as uh, useful as the name would imply. Uh, okay, let's keep on pushing forward here. Orans, Oris Sorens. Oh, I don't, I don't even want to think about Oris Soren spread. No, that's a, unless they're casting spread, that's a different story we got right over there. Okay, so we got ourselves a Mook encounter right over here, and we're gonna be. Uh, exactly. Thank you, Carol. We are in fact on the right track. You're a captain, aren't you? Can't you Arc 3 is really short. Me? Honestly, Act 2 is pretty much the only thing that I was really worried about. And to see how far we were yesterday, combat. I knew I had to do a lot of catch up with overtime. We don't have much time. Let's make this quick. So I hope that <laughs> what we were able to catch up with with the marathon stream after dark, I like to call it. Um, I hope it was enough to compensate for what we're about to do tonight. I say tonight, even though it's early in the morning for me, but I know for some people in other time zones, it may be very late. Uh, okay, so let's uh, get Beast right over here. Uh, Flynn's going to be learning a lot of stuff as we keep on going. And this this set, <laughs> this set, we keep seeing this set every single time at the previous dungeon, and we're going to see more of it. Like, I get it, it's the Alexei's personal guard and all that jazz, but I've seen too much of this, and I've seen two additional... Two additional encounters of this exact same set in the Definitive Edition. That's the Definitive Edition experience. Nothing but, um, nothing but, uh, the same encounters over and over again. Oops, that's my spell cancel, uh, command. My bad. Oh no, it's the Dragon Swarm that nobody likes. <laughs> the Dragon Swarm that is in Yuri Lowell. Alright, and everybody is learning all their stuff, all their altered arts, and all that jazz. Oh, Demon, demonic chaos, I did not time that properly. Good start, good start. Uh, okay, so... This this one's almost done. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Apologize if I'm not reading too much of the chat. I'm trying to get myself uh, warmed up again with this game. Especially considering... Uh, yeah, this game is still really tight, but I'm really hoping... I'm really hoping we can make it tonight. Uh, but yeah, honestly, oh, good night, Patty. Good night. What a great start. This is going to be a good omen for things to come later. All right. Uh, you missed uh, the other streams, followed the channel still. But that's, uh, you know, I appreciate it. Either way, Brave. Uh, Brave Berseria. I thought it said Vesperia for a second there. I see what you're doing with your name there. That's a good, that's a good tag. All right. Yeah, if there's something about this game, there's always, like, mandatory mook encounters, but you also see that in a lot of other Tales games, too. It's not uncommonplace, but, um, considering the length of Vesperia, fitting it in three days is much tougher compared to games like 
um, Berseria, Rebirth, Exilia, Zesteria. Those can fit in three days just fine. It's just this one. This one was already a Goliath and it's 360 release, but it's definitely even more of a mammoth in, in Definitive Edition. I couldn't even guess how long a thorough analysis might take. fun playing this on 360 without well, Flynn to heal? Well, Flynn... I'm guessing we can't just force our way through. Flynn... Hmm... Flynn isn't particularly a good healer. Honestly, uh, Carol and... Um... Raven outclass him. All Flynn has is first aid. And... While that's good for, like, early game... Um... He doesn't... Particularly do so well. Well, can he learn cure? Okay, then color me corrected. If he can learn cure, then good for him. Good for him. I never really got around to him learning cure. Is it because of a weapon that I don't have? It's probably because of a weapon that I don't have. It's most likely because of a weapon that I didn't have and something that I didn't get, that I didn't grind out. Why are you here? You. How is the young lady? See, the thing is, uh, planetario. Um, if I were to do that, then it wouldn't be as entertaining. <laughs> Uh, unlike unlike Vesperia Berseria, I have some more leeway to be flexible. Like uh, I've already said it already, but yeah, this game is gonna be. It's the only one that's really tight. That's all it is. Now Duke here, I I really want to know about the side quest to him because from what we learn about him, like um later on in the game, like for the main narrative, it is like some intriguing stuff. But part of me still wants to be like. I feel like there's some more secrets that I like to connect the dots with, but it's just, it's very particularly interesting because they don't really dig too much into the backstory as much as I would like. There is some of the backstory that is explored, but not quite as much as I, I felt like I wanted more, basically, if that makes any sense. You're as hard-headed as Pharaoh. I thought as a human you'd see things differently. Still canceling the stream on Twitch, okay? Uh... Our common bond as human. Okay, I see some more people here. Uh, Atafe, good morning. Yesterday was chill. Hey, royalty. Glad we got the email. Things sorted out. Uh, how's it going, CP? Yesterday stream. Yeah, that's that's understandable. I'm here for another another couple of days. So, if you're not able to make one day, that's perfectly all right. You don't have to be here every day. That's up to you to decide. She's none of your concern. So back off. And uh, let's get that Troy Baker good performance count going. That's a uh, that's another good that's another good delivery right there. What we know has got nothing to do with it. Our motto is always do what's right. And if that means having to get up close and personal with you, then so be it. Let's do it. Yuri versus Duke, right here, right now. They put Duke's backstory bits behind missable optional scenes. Well. Because, like, there's some things that I'm, like, particularly interested in with, uh, especially with Dane Nomos. Like, that's the one where I'm, like, right here. This thing. I, like, because of, like, the whole lineage behind Dane Nomos, I'm really curious to see, like, everything related with Duke with this blade, particularly. Dane Nomos. Do we know why Troy Baker wasn't called back? We don't have an official story. But um, all we have are speculations, but clearly there was something that must have gotten in the way because I'm pretty sure Bamco wouldn't want to have Troy Baker back. But for what they're able to do, it was okay. Who are you? <laughs> yes, Yuri is me. Who are you? I I mean, fair enough, Duke. I I, I know I'm talking a lot about your backstory. <laughs> yeah, Duke here is mentoring me about this <laughs> marathon. <laughs> Go before it's too late. <laughs> you shouldn't be fighting these answers right now. Thank you, Duke. I appreciate the uh, moral support. If my memory serves me right, we also ran into him in Gasparost. Who is he? You were the only one. Well, you and Raven were the only ones to really notice him. I can't even tell if he's a friend or a foe. Yeah, there's gonna be more of the. The Troy Baker, um, Grand George alternating in the same scene. Again, I, like we've talked about throughout the marathon, that's like the only thing where it's like um, particularly, what are the words I'm looking for? Where it kind of disturbs the immersion a little bit, just an easy bit, but otherwise, um, it's just a minor nitpick, nothing more, nothing less. Maybe major nitpick? It really depends, because. Um, <laughs> 
we, this conversation point has been brought up several times by some of the guests that showed up so far. Like, honestly, uh, the thing is, is that, like, if they have re-recorded Grand George, I'd personally be okay with it. Like, re-recorded the entire game with Grand George, but I know Vesperia diehards. Maybe diehards are a bit too strong of a term. Uh, Vesperia, like, hardcore fans, um, it's just, that's not gonna, like, coast well with them. If, if, uh, what we got right now didn't coast well with them, then imagine what would happen if Troy Baker wasn't there at all. Like, that... That's going to make, like, a huge, huge, bigger uproar than what we have currently. I think people are still... I don't think people still bring it up now. I hope. I don't know. People... I think um, the attention has uh, shifted over to... Oh, let's just focus on the rise and wonder what the heck this... Uh, um, I never got this weapon before. Have I ignored it every single time I went through this dungeon? Oh my gosh. <laughs> All my practices, I missed that one weapon. Sorry, Patty, you're not getting those skills. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like, where is this weapon? I don't remember this. I guess uh, Patty and Flynn won't have a blonde universe. <laughs> yeah, Yuri, you could become the Emperor. I want to be the Emperor even if I could. You're so young. Yet you have no ambition. Whoa, Patty. <laughs> Says the little girl playing dress up. <laughs> What's with the, the deep quote all of a sudden? Imperial succession. When you get down to it, the loss of that sword was the source of all the fighting over the succession to the throne. Yeah. Was See, really the one who I really want to know more about that. Like hey, hey, the history behind break. that. But we're gonna learn more so about Imperial Knights are um, Blastia and Air or things like that instead. I know. This isn't the time for that. He reprised his role in Catherine. I'm, I, I see, like, honestly, there's just a lot of things behind the scenes that we don't know. That's all that it comes down to. It's already been two years. I don't think Bamco's going to give an official word or something. So there's no... I mean, all we have are speculations. We can speculate all we want, but just don't get riled up about it at the end of the day. Maybe it's already gone and passed. Move on. <laughs> but um, just be mindful of what happened, basically. Uh, plain and simple. Maybe it's related to the cataclysm, like the way that the Blastia was lost. Why did that become an imperial treasure? Most of his roles no longer seem to be in Japanese there games. Are tons of things we don't know about. Is because like I remember he did Let's Avengers. Did he, he like? <laughs> they did that weird promo thing with right Avengers, now, where it's like they were they all did a roundtable thing, similarly to like if they were like the live action actors, like in the MCU and. I don't know. I don't think people. I don't think voice actors are quite up there just yet. Like in in the public eye. I don't know. We'll we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I mean, I mean, we already did see. The game's already out. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm I'm back in 2019, everybody. But I still, for some reason, that's still stuck in my head. <laughs> Case of what I just talked about with uh, Grand George and uh, Troy Baker. <laughs> so, hey, it is what it is. There's some good stuff we could pick up here. Uh, ooh, Judex. That is perfect for... <laughs> Can we talk about how the fling... How the Sam Regal character has a weapon called the Judex? Still had, still had to take a double take the moment I saw this. Uh, okay. Let's see what we could equip here now. So Flynn has the Judex. That means we can give him... Yeah, guarding skill, guarding cast, guard arts two. Uh, there we go. All good skills for Flynn Shifo. I think we have to go here. Oh wait, 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 wait. Uh, there's a Mithril plate that I'm missing. <laughs> I need to get that armor because I specifically bought one so that way I didn't have to buy another. Granted, I should have bought another, but oh well. The Avengers Live with Laura Bailey and... Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know what it was, but when I first heard about it, I'm like, hmm. I, I saw what they were going for, but I'm not quite sure if it was the, if the result or effect that they wanted. Because I think they're all just talking, which is fine, but, eh. 
Eh, that's that's a two year old thing anyway. The game is already out, but yeah, I guess I can't think of much else when it comes to Japanese roles or like any roles that Troy Baker does because he I, he's he's hit it big now since uh, <laughs> since uh, the Last of Us. Like that's eight years ago. I'm pretty sure if my math is correct. Because that was PS3, wasn't it? It was totally PS3. Uh, Alright. Oh, okay. So, what is up with this room, specifically? I know there's a puzzle to it, but I never really got it. Like, I felt like they were trying to go for like something similar to Tales of Symphonia, the Temple of Darkness, but it don't... It feels even more easier here. Like you're supposed to light up the these things or something. Feel somebody like tell me what's going on with this area because this is even <laughs> there's less of a puzzle here than a GameCube um, Symphonia. Like they they really fixed the Temple of Darkness in uh in um Unison Pack uh. Chronicles, yeah, Chronicles, yeah, they, the collector's edition giving away, yeah, but they, <laughs> it was harder there, <laughs> but <laughs> they never really thought to fix it in the PS3 version, it's really weird, really weird, I don't know why, you could even use a holy ball to illuminate yourself, you're supposed to fall down intentionally for 100%, well, <laughs> if you thought this was a 100% playthrough on day 3, I'm sorry to uh, disappoint. Uh, I forgot my party set up for this, but I think I might remember if I play around with it. I think I had, uh, Carol, Rita, maybe repeat, maybe repeat, maybe repeat, maybe repeat. Yeah, let's go with repeat. Actually, no, 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 no. Yuri, but repeat hasn't had much screen time. I feel sorry for the little pup. We need to give him some more. He still has his cape from a long time ago. <laughs> we need to give him some action, at least a little bit. I don't want to give Flynn anything too important here. <laughs> uh, 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 I mean, Rebirth Ring would be stupid funny, but okay. Uh, holy Ball, no, Holy Symbol for Repeat. And I think we should be good to go. Gonna do a resave just in case. Yeah, honestly, I feel like the, the old games, um, people are appreciating their dungeon design much better after going through games like Exilia 1, Exilia 2, especially those two games. Even like, I mean, those two are the ones that are like the most guilty of it, but when it comes to puzzles, I still think Zestaria had like the best modern puzzles uh, post-Exilia era. Um, Berseria kind of tries to do it, but it, it kind of hits a bit of a middle ground. An easy bit. He doing them in multiple playthroughs? Yeah, they, <laughs> if, if they had like the remasters, maybe uh, like a quick jump would have been nice for, for that kind of stuff. You know, a stall here. You learn like bits or pieces about a stall in this dungeon, and by bits and pieces I mean one cutscene, optional cutscene that I skipped. It's just, this one just seems like, alright, we need like an Intel Akea right here to emphasize that Alexei is evil. <laughs> and it's like, alright, poor Astol, we barely knew thee. Speaking of which, yeah, I, I, <laughs> it still blew my mind, like, last night when I, like, took a good look at, like, the barrier around Estelle and saw, like, five, um, Apatheia. Yeah, it does make sense that he definitely picked those up in, uh, in the, in the Great War. <laughs> like, that, that's a very good connection to make, whoever made that connection last night. Plus, <laughs> Alexei holding on to that one... Apatheia particularly. I guess he uses it to control Estelle, but <laughs> it still looks particularly amusing. Him just holding this like little little crystal all around. His arm must be sore. 
only Tales game I dislike is Hysteria, but I can tell if it was a bad game overall, but it's still a good Tales game. I'm not as harsh as Hysteria as when I first played it six years ago. Um, I think part of the reason why my Hysteria opinions were affected too, outside of obvious camera issues, number one, um, that year I, would, I played through like four Tales games. <laughs> like I played through... Uh, I think it was Innocence R I finished, then I played Eternia, and then I played Dawn of the New World. So after those three games, I didn't, uh, I, I guess I was tailsed out, sort of. Because, like, I think I streamed Dawn of the New World right before Zestaria. And I just wasn't having, like, I wasn't keeping an open mind, basically. It's or a Pokeball with the style. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Uh, Alexei's been getting his stats with Pokemon Go. That that uh that Apatheia he hovers around is like his cell phone tracker. Yeah, this guy we hardly we hardly learned anything about Estelle. Like Estelle. <laughs> oh, sorry, I didn't mean to talk over Alexei's like best line there. <laughs> How disappointing. He's dead. <laughs> uh, but we never learned too much about a stall. I'm pretty oh, sure, so unless there's some other side quests that I'm missing. Vesperia fans, please uh, let me know. You've come um, this far. But yeah, honestly, now, like a stall, we only learned like some kind. This temple was supposed to worship hands. the Antilochia, that Antilochia specifically. But I, oh, there's the eyebrow. There's the uh, oh, that eyebrow is uh, <laughs> is uh, was mimetic back in the day. That's for sure. But yeah, he's just there. Uh, Assault's just there, and Assault's just gone. Whoa, alright. I'm a minority, but I like what? Zestaria. Did two playthroughs. You'd be surprised to say minority. There are people out there who. St well, actually. Hmm. <sighs> the topic is Zestaria. Six years from now, still. What it's still I absolutely mean, like polarizing. It's like you either you really like it or you really don't like it. Um, sometimes there's a middle ground, and sometimes, but most of the time it's either one side of the fence or the other side of the fence. And, I mean, honestly, for what Zestaria was, I still think it's just okay. Like, it's not... It, like, I gave it a 1 out of 5 when I look back at it, like, 3 years ago. But when I replayed it, I think I bumped it up a little bit to a 2. That's just my, that's just my thing. The anime is a different case altogether that I'm like, Your Highness? that, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, the anime, it's, uh, <laughs> I gave me a reason to watch it, that's for sure. Like, I didn't want to watch Abyss, I didn't want to watch Symphonia, because I could just play the games, but with uh, the Zestaria anime, <laughs> it certainly made me want to watch it. I was really curious about it. I didn't watch it before this year, but I watched it this year. I'm like, wow, <laughs> it is certainly interesting. Pull yourself together. Forget about that, Estelle. Get over here. If there's something you're unsure about, we'll work it out together. Yeah. Yuri. Poor Estelle being used like this. Um, I mentioned this last night for everybody who wants to like the Why? old branded. Oh no, Pan Ban Richard is failing at fights and whatnot. There may be a fight that's oh that eyebrow. <laughs> I get distracted every single time I see it. Who does he think he is? Dwayne Johnson. Um, but yeah, there's just one there's one particular fight in this today that I'm very worried about, and it's not what you think. That's all I'm gonna say about that. So there's a little bit of a tease right there. <laughs> Big old retcons. Well, well. <laughs> I I would like to say it's its own universe. <laughs> like I don't know I don't know what's going on with Zesty the Cross, but it, it does. I'll save it for Berseria. This is Vesperia we're talking about right here, as we're gonna get the big reveal of the guy who never speaks. We've never seen this guy since Act One. Captain Schwan. Oh, thanks, Flynn. You always let your knights handle things for you. What's with the change? Yeah. <laughs> I wonder who he is. Okay, honestly, I I didn't expect it when I first played I it. No I'll remember the reveal of this. I was like, okay, this is pretty cool. But then, whatever happens afterwards, it's 
nothing really happens with it too much. Like, I felt like it was too little of what we're seeing right here. This doesn't look like a joke. But I, I do like this garb, though. One of the unions and I think they did bring this over to Knights? Tales of the Rays. I didn't unlock the, the form change met, for this, but, I didn't think it was it's, possible, but... Oh my gosh. Uh, I, I kind of felt like so they could have spent a bit more time on. with him like this, but it wouldn't have made Wait, sense of the narrative standpoint the dog, at the end Raven? of the day. So it wasn't just the Commandant, but you too. <laughs> Repeat has the most... Uh, um, deepest dialogue in this entire game. Not one of my you just don't know exactly what he's trying to say, but you understand Wait completely man. what he's trying to say. We're in a bit of a hurry, so let us through. Wait, you're not really thinking of trying to stop us, are you? Hi, Luffy. Uh, we're just uh, running into Monsieur Schwan. Schwan what is First it? Captain what is it with this old? Because like I remember there was battle. like a Schwan, and I remember there's a obviously there's a Raven and. There was somebody in the middle, like Dabaron? Does anybody... Vesperia fans, you all know what that is, right? I didn't look too much into it, but I heard bits and pieces about a, a Dabaron chilling around. Oh no. Oh no. Repeat isn't being a suitable replacement for uh, Yuri. Oh no. Oh jeez, this might not be a good start. Uh... <laughs> okay, so there's a strategy that I'm forgetting here. Okay, Carol's still at heal. Uh, this is a very not a good start right now. <laughs> okay. Give me, give me a recovery smash, buddy. Come on. You got it, Carol. There you go. Alright, let's do this thing. Raven's actual name is Damaron? Alright. Yeah, because I've cause I seen uh, circles of Vesperia fans reference Damaron, and I'm like, what is this? I look into it, like, oh, that's what it is. Like, I didn't fully read into it, but I knew that, like, Damaron is also Raven. Like, that's a really, that must be a really hardcore thing, because, like, um, is it mentioned in the side quest in this game? Sorry, and once again, for those who are, like, uh, on the gameplay side of uh, Vesperia, I didn't get too much of a handle of Flynn to, um grasp his spell castles. Like, I know he has them. I, I'm just not quite there yet with them. Particularly because, like, I, I'm doing, like, the... I was gonna say C-Stick, but the right stick to activate the spell and castles, but I'm not, uh... quite... quite dexter... quite dexterous enough to, uh... to nail it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, wait, wait. Nobody... Nobody is set to use items. Uh-oh. That is also issue number two. Um... Actually, you should. You should do up to use. Okay. Actually, defend first. Oh my gosh, he's an OVL. And oh no, OVL is actually a really bad thing for a... Uh, against Schwan here. Was Re Did Repeat walk into that? Because when I left that... When I left that... Oh, oh no, it must have been the mine. Must have been the mine. Drama CD or short story thing? Drama CD or short story thing, okay. Japan, only extra material, some manga and drama CD stuff that goes into the story. Got it. <laughs> he might bug you, but he's not a bug. Alright, uh... Right now, he's close to half HP. Well, he's not quite close to half HP, but he's getting there. Maybe I should map, uh... Uh... Where are we at? Where are we at here? Where's, uh... Dragon, not Yuri's form. Oh no. Rita, 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 Rita. Full charge, let's go. It's not quite my best because I didn't quite fully master Fling because he's barely in the party in the main narrative. Alright. Oh jeez! No, wait! <laughs> wait, Luminous Sight. Uh, no, 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 no. I forgot I have these. I, I didn't get too much time with Flynn to, ex to uh, use the Arts Ball. <laughs> oh, that missed. <laughs> Thanks, Carol, for repairing my, my, uh, my, uh, embarrassment for missing that FS. Wait, wait, wait. See, Carol, Carol's good at healing. He just needs, like, a speed buff to sort of compensate for it, but he's still okay, because, like, usually he's almost always in a flat, uh, flat line. Uh... He's always in the front lines, so that's why it's like, it's not a... I don't think he's as slow as people think he is. Like, yeah, he's slow, but he's not as slow, is what I'm trying to say. Oh. 
Apocalypse Toll. Um, who does he actually have that as base Raven? Ooh, beautiful stun. Hey, repeat, you want to do the thing? Please do the thing. No, he's not gonna do the thing. No, repeat it. No, he's not gonna do the thing. Uh, Carol is really good at healing if you unlock the altered arts for him. Oh yeah, I I never I don't think I ever did like at in any of my playthroughs. The most he's ever gotten was like uh. Oh wait, I gotta attack him now. Oh, too slow. I think I really want to get the. I really want to get the uh the secret mission though, because it gives a really good item I think. So third time he uses his mystic art. I gotta pay attention. Oh jeez. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Uh, Demon Fang. Demon Fang again. Rising Falcon. Tiger Blade. Nope, not in the right red lane. Oh, Rita, 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 Rita. You need a Pine Gel. Oh, that wasn't... I have a terrible aim. Uh, there's too much extra content for Tails as Yeah, of course, yeah. Yeah. I mean, go to the series that haven't been localized too much, but, you know, it's there. I still want there to be, like, the magic... I still wish I could play legit Magic Carta, but I don't recognize any of the Japanese lines. If, if ever I wanted to do another project, maybe English Magic Carta would be pretty fun. Like, I, I find, like, the English, uh, voice clips, compile them together, and then, like, play... Had them as separate MP3 files, and then you know you have the cards out, see what happens. But I I don't think I have that time <laughs> anymore. Okay, let's get back to the defense. I mean, Magic Carta and Grace is, is close, but it's not quite the same effect because uh, original Magic Carta is all about like um, you you hear the actual lines from the game or something, and that's basically how you go with it. Uh, ooh, did everybody survive that? Wow, that's a first. There you go. Okay, we got the... We got the... The... Secret mission. Alright. Carol, you're you're not looking so hot. Can you heal your... Oh, you're gonna heal... You're gonna heal Rita. Wait, why, why did you run back just to run forward again? I get it, you're a little scared, but heal yourself first, buddy. There you go. Now heal yourself again. Double heal, double heal. A little bit for me too, thank you. Ah, uh, good stun, good stun. To those who, who may wonder why I'm not being, um, not doing like base art to altered art or arcane art, it's because I want to be conservative with my TP. This is a game that, um, based on how I'm playing it, because I'm playing it without running into encounters and stuff like that, you gotta like um, be mindful of your TP. And I, and I want to save my resources for like, um, my spellcasters, I don't want to use it on myself, so that's why I try to be very conservative with my arts and whatnot. Um, if, if I really need to restore TP, that's what I have the over limit for. But that's just for me. Or unless my party members just want to do it, so that's when I know if I see my party members use an, use an orange gel on me, I'm like, oh no. I, I'm using more than I should be, basically. Oh jeez, did not take advantage of that. Yee, 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 yee. Hey, I wish your Just Like Dancing was... Wait, Just Like Dancing for, for Raven, was it that, like, um... I'm not gonna say precise, but kind of like... It, okay, maybe precise is the right word, because it looks like it has a bit more precision than if you use it with Raven. There's, there's something about it when I'm looking at it, it's like, it looks like a better version of it. Magna card. Yeah, Magic Card is really fun. Um, that'd be really cool to see, like, in a panel for, like, one of the English Tales, um, Tales conventions out there. English Magic Carta, but it, it certainly does require a lot of work. Okay, run away, run away, no, no, leave, I'm stunned, leave me alone, please, please, uh, get up, Flynn, no, oh, oh my gosh, stun magic for the win, uh, but it's not, wait, did it, yes, thank you, Rita, you're the best, you're the best. <laughs> Do I only have Violet Paint on too? Yeah, that's how we're rolling. Yeah! Oh, we get the Burst Dark 2 from Repeat. Yeah! Oh, did, did not take advantage of that again. Oh. Schwan's getting there, though. Schwan's getting there. Yeah! Oh, we all did our Burst Darts. Good stuff, good stuff. Good stuff, everybody. That's what we call synergy. 
Uh, oh, please leave me alone. Just get a demon fang in. Oh, I was trying to get a rising falcon, but I didn't quite get that in. <laughs> I was about to do the AI thing where I'm like constantly running towards the edge. Uh, another rising falcon. You know, like, the name of the art is Gaia Bug, but... The name of the art is Gaia Bug, but it doesn't involve a single bug at all. Well, it might be a bug randomly out of the objects that he throws out, but... Eh. Ah! Alright, come on, come on, Sean. Ah! No! No! Oh, thank goodness for, uh, for Flynn's card arts! Oh my gosh! Get up, get up, get up, please! Please! <laughs> Oh, that was an OZG! Oh no! I pissed off! I pissed off Schwan! Oh no! Oh no! Stay away! Stay away! Stay away! Please stay away! Get a- get a- get a- get a- get a stun magic in, please! Something! Inferno?! Inferno?! I, oh, wait, how do you know a river dirt if you didn't even speak to that one person? Have you been hiding- have you been hiding out on us? Don't do it! Don't do it! Wow! Wait, okay, here's the thing. If- if you do the secret mission, does he stop doing the Mystic Art? Because if, if he does, then I guess I'm mistaken. I thought he would still use it even after the secret mission. Alright. Ah! <laughs> leave me alone, Chuan. No, leave my- No, 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 no. Fight me. Leave my mage alone. Uh, I guess I did get my wish, but it wasn't quite the result I wanted. Ah! Ah! <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, get a life bottle. Get a life bottle on Rita. Now oh, there I go. We're gonna let that explode before they revive me, because I know there's gonna be some silly things happening if if it does get me. <laughs> Alright, Tron's almost gone. I was just playing a little bit sloppy, warming up to Vesperia, even though I should be warmed up considering how many times I've played, how much time I put into this game over the past two and now third day of this marathon. Stay away. Oh no. Okay, he's almost done. Rising Falcon! Wait, how much HP? 169? Hmm. Hmm. Finish it off. Alright. Alright. How long did I take? Eight minutes? Okay. Well. Hey, we got it. We got it. Imperial Prestige. What's that? Oh, that, that did something with the OVL. So, it is somewhat useful, that's for sure. Alright. And now here it comes. The big moment for... Sir Schwan. Oh, right, you were talking about the Tales of Arise countdown, yeah. I do see that on occasion. It's a nice, uh, that's a nice uh, community project uh, artists are doing together. It's really fun. Um, I do see the uh, art show up on my feed on occasion, but I, uh... I what is that? I already have my own countdown to be aware of um <laughs> of arise such a blow would be the end of me of this cursed body. This was a crazy reveal. What the Is that a And especially the heartbeat effects is a, is a very nice touch. It's his heart. Or this is the one of the things that I really want to pay more attention to with regards to um Blastia because now I'm really paying attention to Blastia and whatnot. It's like yeah, this is this is pretty pretty crazy. I lost my life during that war. It was really not hinted at all. Like they really hit it, and it's it's a good reveal. Like the thing about things that are like unexpected, it has still has to make sense. Like it makes sense because they're like they set like little premonitions where it's like, oh, he fought in the Great War or something, but we didn't realize that he actually lost his, quote-unquote, lost his life during the Great War, and it's all thanks to this Blastia heart. It's, uh, it's really, it was a really cool reveal, and it also adds on to some things we'll learn later on. Some world-building stuff, basically. Thanks, Patty. I would not have noticed. <laughs> it shouldn't be bagging on Patty, but we all know why her lines were added. <laughs> Same with Flynn, too, but at least he was in the story in 360. Shouldn't be bagging on Patty, but, you know, I still like playing as her in battle. Speaking of Patty, we're gonna finally learn about her at the end of... by the end of today, so... I saw the final Schwan song. 
I saw the final Schwan song. Hey, More power man. to you, Wad, I suppose. Time to be standing around. Yes, the let's get out of here. Arrived for me. You never intended to leave this place alive. Oh, is this like a Symphonia sacrifice? No, don't do it, Schwan. Don't do it. This, this is practically a Symphonia sacrifice, let's be real. But I think this one was definitely more believable. <laughs> Honestly, when I first played Symphonia, I didn't think the Symphonia sacrifice were uh, believable at all. <laughs> but here is more believable if we're comparing the two. I thought the guilds never quit until the job was done. Wasn't that his dying wish? I mean, it, it all makes sense. Like, Schwan, like, Raven being like a like a secret agent was it I forgot the term already but uh, the particular agent for for uh, for Alexei and all that like all of this like revealed at once is like oh it all makes sense it all makes sense spy like undercover agent like there, there's a particular yeah double aged something like that yeah that's what I'm looking for thanks what oh no Come on, let's go. This right here. This was cool. <laughs> this was cool, not gonna lie. You did not think, like, the Blastia would, like, power him up like this. Raven! Read the text no! box, kid. It's Schwan. If you use your Blastia like that, the condition you're in, you'll... I can't keep this up forever. Get out of here. Oh, man! Captain Schwan! Alexei's headed for the capital. There, he'll implement the final stages of his plan. The rest. Uh, the final stages. Sayonara, Schwan. Schwan the Raven. They're two completely different birds, but that's what I'm going with. Must be getting soft in my old age. How old is Raven again? Like 35 or something? Somewhere around there. Yeah, he, he he's around like a median age for like like people like uh, Fog, Max, um, Woodrow, Gar. Yeah, they, he he shares similar company with other old um, adults in the series. Ancient and art JRPG land. Yeah. We went into that conversation yesterday, that's for sure. Alive. We got a princess that needs rescuing. Now step to it. Come now. Let's go. Flynn, we heard Yuri. <laughs> you don't have to be the light when he's in the dark. It's nothing. We are actually in a hurry. <laughs> Let's talk him more runny. <laughs> Actions speak louder than words, etc. etc. Just like Raven said. They must have left for Zophius already. The Nanda Monai? Yeah, take a shot of water. Here? I'll take a shot and of water. And Flynn too? LeBlanc? Even well, this voice in, uh, uh, in 360? And what Say, is a Tweedle? Out with it! Fools! This is not the time for nonsense! What wonderful time! You read Lowell's the uh, I, I have no idea you what that is. You didn't happen to see Captain <laughs> did you? We haven't been able to get a hold of him since he went by himself to coordinate with His Excellency the Commandant. Oh, now you start talking about I Commandant Schwan. I mean, not Commandant. Captain Schwan. The Royal Guard won't tell us anything. We looked all over for him and we finally arrived here, but... <sighs> oh, was that something that didn't, uh... uh that wasn't localized Jeff. over... That wasn't localized over? Okay, De Aru? I see, I see. Ah, Sorry, I don't play these games in Japanese unless it's Japanese Captain only. Schwan. Like, I, 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 I completely forgot or, oh, like, ha didn't remember so that, like, uh, Jaeger speaks English in Japanese. The shrine, the I was like, oh, that makes sense. And they localized it over fine by having him speak German. Which throws my joke a little bit out of the water, where it's like, oh, where's Germany in this universe, but... What? Wait, you... No, this is not happening. I'll have to it look into be. that then. If, if that's a Japanese meme, I'll look what into it. I want to be aware. Answer me. <laughs> Captain Flynn. We almost died thanks Good to work. Alexei. 
Good work from uh, that voice delivery. I know that's a redub line, but it's still a good voice work. That man was a true knight. Alexei apparently has some sort of secret plan for the Empire, and it can't be good. We're going to make sure he doesn't get the chance to carry it out. Oh, we really spent an hour there. If Actually, no, we didn't spend an hour there. How long did we spend there? We started around uh, 10 o'clock. We spent around like 40 minutes, 40, 50 minutes. In that dungeon, and most of it was cutscene in the one boss fight. The one boss fight took about 10 minutes. Calculations of time, everybody. Calculations of time, and uh, yeah, I think we're about to wind up by the end of Act 2, but I don't think we're going to be finishing Act 2 before the break. It might... Um, be finished at the start of the next session. So after the break, basically. Oh, wait, I completely forgot one other thing that happens along the way. Actually, no, 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 I'm thinking way too later, but anywho. It's time to look out into the ocean and reflect. Oh, uh, yes, because we've Captain lost our Schwan comrade. was long said to have been the Commandant's right-hand man. He was rarely seen, even among the knights. And it was rumored that all of his missions were top secret. Yeah, they really kept Schwann a it's secret. Probably because he was engaged in work as Raven. So Alexei would even sacrifice his own right-hand man. Was this scene in the 360? Likely, I'm gonna guess it was, maybe, but it's weird because Flynn's there. I don't. It feels Since like it's a scene that wouldn't be in 360 because, like, die. it feels like we could connect the dots ourselves that about this. Damn but Alexei knew it and used it to his advantage. That guy's like a rotting fish. No, oh, Patty. None of that matters. Right now, we have to save Estelle. Got it? Of course. Yes. Right. Let's go save Estelle. Heracles was headed for the capital, right? It's got to be crossing the ocean. Everyone, keep your eyes open wider than a deep sea fishes so we don't miss it. That's two fish puns in a single scene. In a single uh scene there, Patty. You usually have one. Two is a little pushing it. <laughs> All right. Uh, there we are. We caught up to them. Look. Um, I know she has a thing where she says Nanoja, and I think like <laughs> uh, when I was streaming one time, uh, Eclipse, you noticed it, like when. When Patty said that Noja, when she got damaged a lot, so <laughs> um, it, it slipped in this localization. We cannot allow I'll remember that thing that happened all the way back at the start of to Act Two. To the oh, and this would be a Flint thing. You know what? Sodia taking the um, initiative since Flint's not there anymore kind of adds a bit more to her character, not gonna lie. She benefits a bit from this definitive edition, <laughs> surprisingly, because, like, in 360, like, all she does is just tag along. And it's like, oh, there's um, uh, Flint's second in command. But here, to see her actually do the stuff that Flint was doing kind of adds more to her role. And, well. We're gonna talk Wait, more, more about a certain other thing later today. That's for sure. Baul, take us out. Hold on tighter, you'll be shaken off. They're shooting at us. Baul. Come on, Baul. The artillery fire is erratic. There, the rear left. It's the only <laughs> what? Way that yo, the, you know what? Mini games and all that. Okay, this should have been a Star Fox sort of like mini game thing, where it's like you gotta like fly on through. Like, um, there's another game that did it, but I can't quite put my finger on it. Uh, oh, uh, kind of like a, I maybe Bayonetta like, like you gotta like fly through the 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 artillery and make it through. That that would have been really cool, but I, <laughs> like that's for a casual playthrough, but for marathon it would have added even more time, basically. That's been the theme about um, Vesperian and Marathon. Time, time, time. So I apologize for that, but again. Um, as a broken record, I must uh, reiterate that this game is really, really tight. Man, Near Automata's intro to the dead. bullet hell? Oh, that's awesome! The been taken out. I, want, I still want to like try out that game someday. I hope it, so I hope it drops on like Game Pass or something. So weak. I would love to play near Automata, like, just to see the intro, because, like, I love, like, I know people, 
in people generally don't like G, uh, mini games in their JRPGs, but I'm one who does. And uh, the next game in the marathon, Eternia, it will give me so many mini games to play around with. I love mini games and JRPGs. Um, there are some in Berseria, which I I really appreciated um, that they explored a bit of mini games. Some weren't good, but you know what? Some of Eternia's weren't particularly good as well. But um, mini games, I just love mini, mini games in general and JRPGs. I I played a Kingdom Hearts two like a long time ago, and I liked the gummy. Uh, segments in between like I like I spend time customizing my gummy ship and making sure that I oh whoa Raven hey I didn't get this though how were they able to save him so quickly <laughs> how were we, how were they able to save him so quickly I would have waited a dungeon personally to to add more of an effect to Raven but this was way too quick so happy to see me cats got your tongue what are you doing here old man See, now there's an example of hearing the line, Cat's got your tongue, in like a joking matter, because I used to say almost 100% of the time, Cat's got your tongue is like a very silly line in general, but Troy Baker was able to make it sound like serious and dramatic. <laughs> you can't, like, that's one of the impossible lines to sound, to make it sound that way. Cage 2 soured you on minigames, Platinum's trophy, yeah. That's part of the reason why I'm not a trophy hunter, because I know, like, it would kind of sour me in general. But I know the appeal for trophy hunting, that's for sure. Uh-oh. Yuri. Yuri, we don't need another body count here. Cutscene stabs aren't good. Don't do it. But before I knew it, I was waist deep in all this. If I have to be done in by you guys here, well, there are worse ways. All right, I can see a little, little similarity to the other character we were talking about before, but that's where I can kind of draw the line. Is that what you mean? I've been a dead man for over ten years. Are you the Undertaker? Dead guy like yourself doing here anyway. And then they brought your gimmick back because they need to make more money. Anywho, that's a deep cut reference to everybody. If anybody in the audience knows that. Brave Asperia would be pleased to take care of that. Hey, DM. Yuri? Chill, buddy. Don't do it. <laughs> Straight up Harry Maker. <laughs> Way to go, Yuri. Your life belongs to Brave Asperia now. <laughs> uh, I do like how, like, uh, he, he starts off as if it was he was talking to Kumar and Rago and just, like, does a complete 180 That's right perfect, there. Yuri. That's when you know the guild has, like, grown. And I appreciate the guild being used as a platform for this. <laughs> this is what does she do? Does she... She punches him, or pushes him, or stomps on him? Oh, there you go! <laughs> a swift jab. Want to feel left out. <laughs> Rita, you ain't even part of that guild. You ain't a part of that guild. You don't deserve to do that. Yo, you, you too. What was that? An Ekas a hip again? Come on, Patty. Raven, do you know where Alexei's hiding? I think he's in the control room. That's a good expression. The cell shady really complimented that right there. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? <laughs> that line followed by those expressions. Good. Huh? Hmm. Oh, oh yeah. I, well, I managed thanks to LeBlanc and his men. It's pathetic, really. How? It really was you all this time? I guess it wasn't so bad after all. I don't know. I still felt like they should have waited one dungeon, maybe, to sort of like build up his return, but. I know the idea of not having Raven at this point at the party, but hey, they did it. They're doing it with the stealth right now. Maybe that's why, because they're already doing it with the stealth. Then I guess we both. I get it from a gameplay perspective. I get it. How about we go pay him back? Yes, I'd like that. Um, bit confused by the scene. There's like a strangely similar scene in Persona Five. I can't comment on Persona Five because I didn't play it. 
Um, but all I can say is that the build-up for this game it was kind of amusing for me here. When I play Persona 5, um, I'll get you a rain check for that. Alright. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do a lot of replenishing here. Oh, you know what? I was supposed to rest somewhere first, because now... Actually, no, we don't need to rest. This dungeon, we don't run into encounters anyway. We should... <laughs> Yo, do y'all see that enemy there just going wacky for a moment there? That was weird. Anyway, uh, let's pick up this stuff. Uh, we got some lunges. Uh, maybe two pines. Uh, oh, maybe we'll need some poison bottles. Just a little bit more. Uh, a couple life bottles, holy bottles. Uh, we got a. L oh, I thought we got a lot of mats. We we did have a lot of mats. We have a lot of magic lands, which is very normal. Uh, eggs, bread, rice, sticky flour, potatoes. Everything looks okay to me. Oh, but we can craft the Limit Quartet. Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. All right. Uh, I don't think we got anything else here to really get. Anything. We'll never get any of these, which really sucks. <laughs> uh, ooh. I don't have those skills, so it don't matter. Uh... Dragon Tooth already got. Uh, wait, was there the one with the item? No, never mind. Okay, we should be good. Should be as I keep double checking here to make sure I'm not missing anything. Okay, we should be good. Uh, I think my team was a. Uh, we got a uh, team kids. Holy bottle up. Hmm. Uh, buy a holy bottle. <laughs> Use a holy bottle, buy a holy bottle. This dungeon... This dungeon... I can't tell you the amount of times I got lost in this dungeon. Only because two areas look very similar. That's why you can get easily lost here, so <laughs> be careful. Be careful with the, this one every single time you show up. All right. I keep hearing good things about Persona 5. I started off with Persona 4 Golden. I was like, all right, this was good. This was a lot of fun. It, um, and then I played Persona 3 um, on PS2. How? <laughs> How? How? That was barely... Come on. Well, let's just learn stuff, I guess, while we're here. Okay, uh, where was I? Oh, yeah. Uh, I, I played Persona 3, and I'm like, uh, PS2 version. Uh, Mario Kart, and oh, it doesn't help. So, I'm, like, thinking, should I go backwards and do Persona 1 or Persona 2, or should I just go straight to Persona 5 Royal? Because I did dive a little bit into Persona 1, and I'm like, whoa, this is kind of cool. Because I like going around the mazes and all that, and positioning is pretty interesting. Like, yeah, that's why I want to play it. P1 and P2 are really different. And I feel like if I... Okay, you know what? In that case, maybe I should just go straight to 5. Because I would still have 4 and 3 fresh in the mind. Yeah, that might be the, the best thing at the end of the day. But I really, really want to play 1 and 2 because they're different. It really interests me. Especially the fact that, like, I heard Persona 1 has, like, alternate paths. I want to see, like, out what I get without a guide. Like, I want to, like, just play it normally and see what happens. Now, what the, the question is, which version should I play? Should I play the one on the PS1 Classic or should I play the one on PSP? Because I have both. <laughs> I know people really don't like the PS1. Actually, it's kind of weird because, like, PS1, people are like, the soundtrack is really good on PS1 and I could hear it. That's some, that's some really cool tunes that, that they got in that game. Uh, PSP is a little bit more like your usual, it, it kind of assimilates to the standard that P3 and P4 were making. Yeah, we were together when that happened. Let me see that. Uh, I like the weird techno beats or something like that. Uh, I've always wanted to hold hands with you, Rita. This clearly wasn't voiced in, uh, in, uh, 360. It's being affected by the air. 
The interior geometry is changing. See, like Michelle Ruff is, is now back to good old Rita. Try pointing it at this gate. Maybe she didn't have a cold before then. I don't know what it was, but either way, she did it. She's doing great now. Than it was before. Are you sure that's okay? If it can destroy everything it shoots, that would definitely be dangerous. <laughs> that was a reaction between the air inside the gate and the See, air. See now, the now I'm shot. thinking more like because like of uh, uh, Grant, uh, Grant laugh. George's lines in um, in Shadows Let's of Valentia for uh, Fire Emblem, and I'm like, too. um, I can now not get that out of my head and like not think of a uh, Clive from uh, whenever I hear Yuri now. <laughs> uh, Clive was a uh, anyway, <laughs> let's uh, go through this really long dungeon right over here. Uh, there's something we got to pick up. Reflex, which is really good. Um, let's throw that on uh, Carol, because he's going to be fighting. Oh no, I didn't mean to pick it up! Darn it. My bad. Yeah, yeah. ED, EDM brings up a good point. That's pretty much why we, we, we can't beat him up anymore. We need him to heal. We need him to heal. <laughs> yeah, no, CP, you know what's up. I, I, my bad sense of direction really affected me here, too. And the encounters that I ran into were not helping. <laughs> I did not have any dark bottles to bait things out, so that, that also did not help me at all. Um, the first question wasn't given yet. There is still time. Um, we also started a little bit late, I think. We started, like, about ten minutes late, so... The break period will also happen a little bit later, too. Wonder symbol, very important. Make sure you give that to Rita. Um, that's only for, like, at this point in the game. For the final bosses, final couple of annoying bosses, you want to give her a fairy ring instead. Just to supplement uh, resource use. Uh, I'm only saying this stuff, like, particularly for... Um, yeah, I, sorry, yeah, re really pay attention to my notes here, because, uh, like CP said, you could get really lost here really fast. Um, but, yeah, like... With regards to this run, I want to maintain my resources as much as possible, so putting a fairy ring on Rita is definitely going to be my priority. Listen to what these guys say and make sure you remember it. <laughs> because if you are skipping cutscenes, you're not going to hear this and get lost like intentionally. The room to me. There are quite a few of the Royal Guard there. That sure is some heavy security. It doesn't look like it'll be too easy to stop it. It doesn't have to know a lot of these rooms look really, really samey at the end of the me. What? <clears throat> As I was saying, uh, it doesn't really help that these uh, rooms all look very similar at the end of the day. We've come this far. Don't you think we should be careful not to mess things up? I think that if we can stop the Heracles, Sodia and her men will be able to get on board. No matter how I never noticed this, but it looks like the English V18 reuse the same. Well, yep. Let's search the control room. At the end of the day, like the the actor pool for outside of Japan is not as big as the actor pool in Japan, so it's gonna happen. And also, there's things about like different casting agencies, different groups. That's more so about who Bamco employs for case, well, voice actors as opposed to the amount of actors. Well, a part of it is still the amount of actors, but also who people, gets casted basically. The entire Royal Guard. Sounds like a lot of trouble. <laughs> it's okay, EDM. <laughs> Honestly, it this is a nine day marathon, <laughs> so I don't mind if topics get brought up again and not everybody's here every every day. I appreciate those who are here every day. Um, but it's more like um, everybody has, uh, different schedules in their lives, so I don't mind if topics are brought up again. Uh, let's see here. Dark bottle, bring it out. Holy bottle. I remember watching your streams, the clips, <laughs> back in the days. Like, oh, I remember the dark bottle, holy bottle strategy. Maybe I should start implementing that, <laughs> just to pick up treasures. Um, it's always you-know-who sometimes. 
Oh, you remember discussing it? Okay, cool. <laughs> All right. Uh, that's totally for Patty. Uh, can kiss. Uh, I gotta make that mark. I'm using the older device to keep track of these skills now because I really. I look back at it and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so far behind uh, on keeping track of these skills. So when I get. When I do get uh, Estelle back, I'm going to have to um, take time to look at her skills. <clears throat> uh, let's see here. Raven. Yeah, I also have to do it for Raven right now, so please bear with me a little bit here. Because uh, he does actually is supposed to have uh, strength too. I just forgot to note it. Um, we're also at Heracles, so he gets additional skills here. That's the thing with these uh, uh, reunions with certain characters. They come back with even more skills, so um, I try to replicate it as best as I can. Okay, we got that. I think we got Bullfight Mind. Uh, here we got a... Uh, ooh, there's a lot that I'm missing here. Holy smokes. Maybe I'll do it during the break, because this is... Uh, I realize this might take a little bit longer than expected. Uh, we, well, we definitely got high Tauntan Headhunter, though. And OVL bonus. Uh, did we get everything? Oh, I'm missing one. What's the one? Uh, change style, special, guard plus, burst guard. There we go, burst guard. Cool. Yeah, the game industry in general does reuse actors, and... It's all a part of the industry at the end of the day. Do I need to go to the left here? No, I don't. We're fine. <clears throat> Alright. There are really only three screens to worry about. <laughs> Outside of the out... Like, three indoor screens, four... Uh, two outdoor screens. And... It... You would think there were more screens, but this place... <laughs> They all look so samey that, like, you feel like there's, like, five or six screens, but no, it's just three screens to worry about. Oh, am I doing... Yeah, so, hey, <laughs> you know what? I'll give Vesperia credit. It hid... It kept block pushing away until this moment. Like, <laughs> Vesperia, thank you. Thank you for not uh, falling into the... The, uh... The habit that other Tales of Games did. Uh, around this time, like Symphonia is guilty of block pushing, <laughs> very guilty of block pushing. If I remember, Abyss is also uh, guilty, but not as much as this as Symphonia. That's for sure. <laughs> no, it is exactly. Vesperia's block pushing even isn't even that bad anyway. I'm only just bringing up scars because of Symphonia. If you are a Symphonia fan, if you started off with Symphonia, block pushing, block pushing, block pushing. Oh, Legendia's not that bad. Legendia's was fine because it keeps it in one screen. Well, that's Legendia's like the issue with Symphonia is that their blocks are so f where you have to push the blocks are so far. It's and Lloyd and the characters move so slow. Like at least the character you're controlling in Legendia, they move fast with the blocks too, and they kind of keep the speed here. Even if he was facing a precious friend like you. Yuri isn't the kind of person who can so easily kill others. But if he felt he really needed to, I imagine he'd even kill me. <laughs> it's why I have like a an instant negative reaction to block that? pushing. It's all because of Symphonia. I blame Symphonia for that. There was sadness in his eyes, but he was unwavering. <clears throat> then it's true. But that kind of determination must be heartbreaking. I'm gonna need to brew some more tea because apparently my voice Even hasn't isn't tea quite tea. at hundred percent yet. But we're we're going, we're going. I believe he's determined to live the rest of his life with that pain. Yuri possesses just that kind of strength. You think so? This conversation is kind of interesting because crime after crime? um, Flynn and, and Patty are having a deep conversation. Myself. But if you don't know about Patty, it it I does come it does come off a little bit weird down. at first. Flynn, Maybe really she needed here. more scenes to sort of, sort of establish her ma maturity I? a bit. I to make this scene work a bit better. <laughs> but for what it is, it's okay. It gives the, the exclusive character something to do. The two characters are like analyzing the plot just as we're doing right now. <laughs> okay, uh, we got Holy Bottle up. 
All right, Guardian Stamp. Let's give that to Carol. Carol Capel. Oh, that reminds me. When Carol was first revealed, everybody kept calling him Mini Lloyd. And I think they still call him Mini Lloyd right now. Like, it, it's not as, like, frequent, but back in the day when we didn't, uh, when Vesperia still didn't come out, everybody kept calling Carol Mini Lloyd. I don't think it still catches on now, but, um, I forgot that that was such a common thing back then. Then he got the Lloyd cost. Oh, did he? Oh, oh, oh. You find that in this game, huh? I didn't explore much of the cameo costumes in this game, to be honest. And I also forgot that cameo costumes in this game have arts attached to them. Uh, just reminded about it yesterday. Uh, no, two days ago, basically. So, um, the fact of the matter is, is that, like, when it came to the arts, I still haven't fully explored them all yet. Like, Yuri's Tiger Blade? I forgot he had that. I honestly forgot. Yeah, I, I, I need to... Okay, does anybody know... Like, this is really not spoilerish for me, but... Um... Can anybody, like, list the, the cameo arts we get from each... Oh, I'm not supposed to be here. Uh... Can anybody, like, list the cameo arts we get from each costume for each character? Because I know Yuri is Tiger Blade, because I never had Tiger Blade for Yuri at all. Um, uh, Fling gets, like, the, <laughs> the Eternal Sword time-space skills. Holy smokes. <laughs> I think a cameo costume would give him that crazy capability. Um, but I don't know the others. I, I'm really curious about it. I, I would look it up, but I, I, I don't have the time, unfortunately. Yeah, you know what? Block pushing, there was only one thing we had to push. It wasn't much of a block pushing thing. Way to go, Vesperia. Thank you. I don't have to think about the pain that Symphonia has, like, brought to me so many times when it comes to block pushing. <laughs> uh... Uh, where are we at, though? Oh yeah, this is, I, I guess this is the second instance of block pushing, but it's so minuscule that it, it's negligent. <laughs> Vesperia during this time is probably like the best of how it dealt with block pushing, I suppose. Um, well, I mean, the stigma of block pushing that um, the series got thanks to Symphonia. There were, there's other block pushing in some of the older games like uh, Rebirth and Eternia, but they're not in, in a function that you would normally expect. It's a little bit different, and I, I'm pretty sure Eternia will be running into that one, for sure. Yuri de Demon Attack. So Tiger Blade isn't uh isn't a cameo. Uh, then I guess I I missed something. Is it a side quest for Yuri? Okay, it's probably a side quest for Yuri. Estella's Phantom Blade. Carol Blazing Tempest. Rita Burning. Oh, cause it's Maul. Yeah, that's cool. Burn Strike. Awesome. Um, why am I going back down here? Um, Raven Elemental Master? No. No. Ravens is Elemental Master? I remember Judith having Bloody Rose. Ele elemental Master. <laughs> I'm still trying to process that. Holy smokes. Oh, you know what? I, 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 huh. I don't remember Ricardo having Elemental Master on Innocence R. I would have remembered something like that right away, or maybe I missed it, but, hmm. I thought, I keep thinking Max Elemental Master. <laughs> like, that, that's the first thing that comes to mind to me whenever I hear Elemental Master. It's all about Max. The best mystic art, I want to say. That ha that has to be a mystic art for Max. And when he showed up in a uh, race, he had that as mystic art. Elemental Master is the best. One of my favorite favorite things ever. What in the? The royal guard have been taken out. Oh, it's this guy again. 
I thought we got rid of him. Why does he always show up? Where's the commandant? It's you. You were the one who wiped out all these people. I don't want anybody else getting in my way. We got no time to play with you. Where's Alexei? We really don't. We honestly, we really don't. This game is already really long as as is. Was using this fortress as a decoy. Oh yes, he was. Charitable of him. He's a real piece of work. <laughs> Good line by George. Got to hand it to him. He drew the knights and all of us to Heracles. You know, y'all talking about Johnny Young Bosch. It was Johnny Young Bosch in Berseria. I want to say that was JYB, and I think some people yesterday confirmed that for me too. I'm like, is that JYB? I was so distracted by JYB that I didn't even like think about what that NPC was saying. Uh -oh. Hey, hold on a minute! Aren't you forgetting someone? Shut up! This I boss fight is stop. still more of the same of what we've seen. I There's just one it's myself. just one extra We've gimmick. No you, so take a walk. <laughs> like I get it though. Like you they, they wanna bring back it like there's nothing bad with Zoggy just like showing up again and again, but <laughs> the only really thing that happens is like um Hate me. Yeah, later on in the game Hate basically. Me. There is no finer spice in all the world! This guy just can't get off our back. Just in our way to make his I even forgot what guild. Yeah, exactly. What guild is this guy in again? Now, let us I don't even remember anymore. Is he Blood Alliance? He was Blood Alliance, wasn't he? But he's still hanging around. Leviathan's Claw? Okay, thank you. I thought it was Blood Alliance. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's turn on form change and uh, let's let the dog use this. I'm so happy to see you again. Ooh, what'd you learn? Woof. I'm so happy to see you again. Woof. Okay, uh... Oh, she learned Ground Dasher. Ooh, that's really good. That's perfect for this, actually. Oh, she learned Card Dasher. Patty is, like, insanely fun. Like, her her RNG is just... It's stupid fun. RNG is, like... I know, like, like super hardcore gamers may not like, her, like RNG, but from a casual perspective, RNG makes things fun for me. <laughs> oh, no! What the heck happened? Wait, what's that? I whoa! I never unlocked that. I never, I never seen that uh, altered art for uh, for uh, repeat before. Huh? Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, where's Gale Dog? Uh, Shining Dog. Let's put that there. It's a pretty good OTG move. Uh, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. Uh, yeah, I think I, I think I'm good. Okay. Those gimmicks alter how hard he is, but they're so easy to clear because of the secret missions. <laughs> like, both of them are really easy to clear. Okay, no, 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 no. Here's the thing. I'm talking about, um, Zagi 1 and Zagi 2, there's definitely a difference between them. But Zagi 3 and Zagi 4, it's like, well, their gimmicks aren't particularly to the point where it's like, oh, um, their secret missions are very easy to clear, so it just feels like we're fighting Zagi again, if that kind of makes sense. Did that wrong? Man, that that whirlpool uh, burst start is much more useful with repeat. Wait, can I not link? Oh yeah, that's the thing. I can't link Falling Leaf to Cyclone Shot. <laughs> Unlike this guy over here who could do it just fine. He, he's been doing it since the very beginning of the game. It was just about to do it there too. Yeah, let's go. Beat him up. Beat him up. Oh, she, she got critical. Perfect. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Patty's got re <laughs> She does have gamble caps. Thank you, Patty. You're the best. You're the best. Yeah. You know, whenever I hear her say da 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 da, it's like, you know, you know, the enemy's in for pain. Oops. 
Maybe Zagi would have been... He doesn't even have a Mystic card in this fight. It would have been nice. <laughs> I love it. Every single time I see it, I love it. Oh, it's not going to hit? I ain't going to hit. Ooh. Wait! Wait! <laughs> As you can tell, I didn't explore too much of a uh, of Rapide's altered art, so this is fun. Punching Air Fang is better than holy smokes. Okay. Okay. I, I see, I see it, I see it. I see it, okay. I guess the closest thing to uh falling leaf is uh Sonic Dog Cycle Shot. We'll go with that. Oh, okay, okay. Oops, I forgot the, uh, the extra manual hit. Oh! So here's gonna be the thing now, um, for these bosses from here on forward. Uh, it's gonna be... It's gonna be, uh, what are the words looking for? Like, the bosses aren't particularly rough themselves. It's more like, because of my current setup and damage output, it's gonna take longer. So, um, just be mindful for that for the rest of the day, basically. Boss fights are just gonna take longer today. So it's like, it's weird. Like, the, the whole difficulty curve of, like, um, 10 times experience, no encounters, um, skill inheritance and all that, it's like, it's like up there first because of item management. It goes down a little bit because of, um, um, how higher leveled we were. And it goes up again near the end because the bosses are just, like, beef kicks, basically. Patty, <laughs> high tier spells that Rita. Well, she only knows Ground Dasher, but other than that, she can't really cast anything else. Well, I guess, I guess, I guess. Oh, bloody howling! <laughs> yeah, let's get a, let's get a over the minute. Uh, oh no, oh no, he's mad. <laughs> he don't, he don't like him in over limit. Oh, 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 oh! Don't do the loop. You were about to do the loop. I, I saw it. My flash almost... My, my life almost flashed before my eyes. Alright. Running around, running around, running around. Go for the offensive. Oh, that don't work. Wait, I should try more of a punching air fan. Oh, so, so, you know what, I guess he did kind of fix his Blastia now, so I guess, I guess that's a bit of a difference, because, like, now his Blastia doesn't overload, unlike, um, when we fought him at Nordopolitan. Oh, jeez. Ah! Alright. Yo, Punishing Air Fang is really good, holy smokes. I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> Alright, so here's the gimmick. Poison Perfume. Oh no, this could mean he could poison our entire party. Oh, well that didn't last too long. I think we're about even now. Nothing changed, Zagi. <laughs> Nothing changed. <laughs> yeah, so basically all I gotta do to prevent his poison ailment, just use uh, Carol's uh, uh, nice recovery smash, basically. Man, I'm not really doing good with this. Um, I didn't expect to have not as much mobility as I'm using right now. Oh, what the? What the? What happened there? Oh, wait, what? Did he get hit by that large hitbox of Zoggy's? Oh, weird, okay. Alright. Yeah, this boss fight I can see lasting for like another four minutes because we're currently around like the halfway point. Like, what was that hitbox there? <laughs> Did it? That was weird. That was really weird. No! No! Okay, Patty. Oh, wait, no, she's back in normal. Darn it. She Brainiac? I'll take Brainiac. She'll do crazy stuff in, uh, in that, uh, with, with Risky Cast. Away. Yeah, <laughs> I love, I love risky cast. All right, all right. 
Um, anybody who played Definitive Edition, how often have you used Patty in your party? Like, I hope almost all the time, because you can do stuff like that! Revive! <laughs> Uh, hold up, you- Ah, no, 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 let's just have her play around. Let's do another form change. You main Patty? Good, good. <laughs> just stupid fun. Stupid fun character. Critical moment? Yeah, I wish- You told me about it yesterday, I wish I could have played around with Critical Moment. I feel like it's a missed opportunity now. Second most used character after Yuri? Yeah! <laughs> Like, Patty, gameplay-wise, is so much stupid fun. And I still remember when I was first introduced to Patty in Tales of the Wraith, and thanks to the training, uh, training mode, training mode we've been wanting for a long time, but thanks, Wraith. Um, training mode of Wraith, I, I played around with Patty a bit, and I'm like, is she this quirky in the original game? And then when I got to her, I'm like, six pages in the battle book? Yeah, she's this quirky. I was so excited once I got to use her. Oh, no, she lost it. Oh, well, she, she has form change on her, anyway, it's okay. Barely took her out of my party after she joined. Main her, she was like, yeah. Good, good stuff, everybody. She's stupid fun. It's like, you could tell, oh, no. You could tell that she was, like, a character added to this game. <laughs> like, battle-wise and narrative-wise. She's, like, mini looker a little bit, too. Oh, she's in critical. Oh, no, Rita. Rita, 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 Rita. Uh, pine gel, please. We ran out of orange shells? Really? Okay, okay. Uh, you know, watch for TP. Actually, no. It, sh it should be up to you. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Prefer playing as Rita, but Patty's a close second. Yeah, that's the thing. I really wish I could give more time to the mages of this game, because when I tried to try them out during my practice, it wasn't quite... It didn't quite excite me, but I know there are, like, some skills to learn in order to unlock their capabilities, basically. <laughs> Ground Dasher and Violent Pain. Thank you, Patty. You're the best. Bloody Howling, y'all. Let's go. Bloody Howling started to become a thing, I think, in Abyss, if I remember correctly? It was Abyss, right? No! I'm stupid! Eternia! Eternia! Eternia did it first. Eternia did it first, and then it started to become a... They did... It used it in and out, basically. Oh, did I miss that? No, I got it. Yeah, I completely forgot about Eternia. Yeah, Patty's on a roll. It's so fun. And I'm not even like trying- Oh, she's out of TP. Oh, they're both out of TP. Uh, <laughs> another fine gel in. Ah, leave me alone. Uh, get her another- uh, Get her on the launch. I can't, I can't believe I almost forgot about Eternia. Bloody Howling is everywhere in that game, too. Like, near end game, so we're gonna see that a lot, that for sure. You know, that burst arc took him out of the magic guard and kept it going. Does this move OTG? No, I don't think. Would it OTG? Hmm. Or, like, hit him off the ground? Or just hit him in the ground? Carol still has that, uh. <laughs> that revive that Patty gave him a long time ago. And if you've been in the Abyss, yeah, I, I, yeah, I had a feeling that one of the party members did. Man, punching Air Fang is a little bit more reliable than Light Spear, actually. I mean, Light Spear has more range, but punching Fang, like, has less, uh, TP consumption. Oh, Patty. Uh, everybody's really low on that TP. Well, it's almost done anyway. Do the thing! Ah! I said, do. No, no, no. Alright, sure. <laughs> Let's just win with the four of a kind, which happens in a lot of poker hands, to be honest. What is with this guy? I never thought he'd be here. I swear, you should give it a rest.
10 minutes 60 great save me save me <laughs> okay yeah that 10 times the XP really does help at the end of the day even though I'm avoiding every single encounter oh I didn't notice the TV screens there they're showing the rest of the dungeon there that's kind of cute it's all because of uh, the easy abyss. <laughs> we just launch him off the, out the window, shall we? Cutscene Azure Edge. Never underestimate it. Alright, speaking of boss fights, looks like we just finished our boss fight. It's time for the related question. Uh, make sure to follow the instructions on bit.ly slash toms3 giveaway. If you're not aware of the instructions, I'm sure all you guys may be aware of the instructions right now. Uh, the question is, which boss do we fight at Bakhtin? Where have they taken you? Your time starts now. Rita. She's nothing more than a tool to Alexei. If he keeps forcing Estelle to use her power, she could really unleash the Autophagos. Not on All right, much. the Autophagos, that thing that we kind of mulled over <laughs> yesterday. That's what we're here for, right? Rita, cheer up. Did it say Heracles? Hold up, let me fix it. Save Estelle. Right. I knew I forgot something today. We don't have a moment to lose. Heracles must be using a Hermes Blastia too. That's the only thing that could power something this big. Okay, it should be updated now. Please put the answer for Bactian, not a uh, Heracles. Baul can help us follow the disturbance. That's how far behind we are, by the way. I thought we were gonna finish this before today, but we didn't. We didn't. Alright. It should be fixed now, I hope. Oh jeez. Sudden fireball out of nowhere. Yuri! This isn't over yet! The control panel! And this guy's nothing but like, like a like a cockroach. He just keeps coming back. Body. It's no use. We can't treat everyone at once without a stale healing arts. All right, is the question fixed for everybody? I presume it's fixed now. I hope. Ah uh, yes, that's wonderful. Let's do it. Double kick. Foot dive. <laughs> Foot dive followed by a blast. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yo, they just did an MVC3 thing. They totally did an MVC3 thing. <laughs> Never realized it till now. Jaeger, what's going on? Yeah, what the heck, Jaeger? I thought he was on your side. It's very bad for business indeed if the Empire got too big for its britches. Oh, I see. Alexei has gone to Zafius. I guess I guess that's your motivation, huh? Has a secret, you know. I thought for sure that he'd need Dane Nomos to use as a key. Yeah, but it looks uh, even like even Jaeger thinks uh, the commandant is a threat. What? What is he planning on doing to her highness? It doesn't look like Very good, a good time to discuss this. Also a good point, Judy. This isn't good. At this rate, we're going to flatten the lower quarter of Zophius. Yeah, this thing is really huge. I we only see this like twice. This is our second time seeing it. I mean, the the dungeon uh, complements its size, but jeez, what the heck was uh, Alexei really doing with this? Just for a distraction? Oh, you know what? No, they do explain it later. And I mean, Jaeger basically said it. He does have a use for it, thanks to Estelle. Let's think about that later. Right now, we've got to stop. This is pretty much his Plan B that he's now using for a Plan. Well, it's still using it for a plan A. Let's go for a different reason. Jaeger, you won't get off the hook next time. Oh, no Carol be pissed. Me. Not even the boss of Brave Vesperia. Same with Raven. Both of them are fixed. Or... Yeah, it's for VS7. That's the seventh pin. Um, we we went through six pins over the over the past two days. I would hope I would hope that's right. I'm not I'm not that crazy. Am I am, am I I'm not losing it that much, am I? <laughs> okay. Uh We're going to take the shortcut that we made down here. Thank goodness for shortcuts. And 
let's keep on going through. Uh, what's going on here? Yeah, we, we gotta leave through here, and then we gotta go all the way back to the engine room. Uh, yeah, so now we gotta go back to this big door over here. Actually, maybe we can... Re no, 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 let's not spend time restocking on items. There's another place where we could uh, restock on supplies, so we got that to deal with over there. And now we have the chance to go all the way back down here. Rose Whip. Let's see what that gives Rita. Combo plus ooh, Vitality 2 and Recovering Guard is good. Uh, where are we at here? Recovering Guard, Vitality 2. What's the other skill that you got? Did I miss Recovering Guard? No, I got it. Uh, combo, I mean, Combo Plus, it's probably good for her, but I'm not getting the skills for her to fully utilize that. Uh, let's see here. Oh, and this is where Flume show up. But again, like, there, there's a lot of this where Sodia gets a lot of this, a lot of these lines. She gets more screen time and more attention, which is nice to see. She gets more of a build. <laughs> Compared to just being, I'm Flint's Flacky. Flacky, what's that, like a lackey and a... Not, not carrying the flak or something? Cutscene Demon Fang and Azure Edge! Yeah, it's been a while since Act 1. Captain, Very dangerous okay. combo right there. I'm impressed you beat all these guys on your own. I don't recall asking for your help. Hey, you we saved you. Thank you. We saved you. Yeah, exactly. I will never give thanks to you as long as I live. You didn't think I could. That was a flip flop between the away, two voices that didn't bother me as much. Sodia. This is hardly the time. Captain, why are you always defending the Jeez, how many times <laughs> am I gonna say Flynn. This? We don't have time to mess around with you. If you really want to do this, Man, then we Yuri won't be pissed. Back. There's something else we've gotta be doing, so try and keep out of the way. Rita's pissed too. So you plan to rescue Lady Everybody's Estes? pissed at Sodia. What has she ever done to gain yeah. all this hate? So come on, put down your sword. He's right, you know. Nobody come out a winner in this fight. Captain Schwan. The name's Raven. You'll remember that for me, won't you? Get it right, Sodia. Yuri Lowell. I mean, yeah, pointing a sword is certainly certainly reason number one, but we also have a sword right out there too. So we're also not really in the right there. But I'll do as I please. Granted, we are defending ourselves, so you know that is the reason. Vice Captain. And Captain Flynn, too? I'm so glad you're here. We're engaged in battle. There's too much of a difference in firepower between our fleet and the Heracles. We won't last much longer. I must ask that you please take direct command. It does seem like do. really going at it out there. I'm begging you, sir. Captain, I can't <laughs> Yo, we see a blue knight walking in. I wanted him to be voiced by Sam Regal. That would have been the ultimate throwback. I want to see Sam Regal speak to himself. <laughs> we'll be fine. I'll join up with you later. Let's go. Later. It's gonna be a while, buddy. Looks like the knights are having a hard time too. If we don't bring this thing down right now, they're gonna have more than just a headache. At least you give good time in between the the differently voice lines here. I, I I know it's designed with the Japanese dub at, at first, but it, it wasn't like how they're they're spreading it out basically. But based on how it ended up, it's uh it still ended up sounding not as bad as the other ones. Ay jai! <laughs> Run away, please. Run away as fast as you can, please. Do I need now? Here's the question: Do I need ten thousand gold? I wonder. Do I really need ten thousand gold? It might be worth it. It might be worth it. Maybe ten thousand gold is a good thing, but the problem is that it is an unavoidable encounter. Maybe. Let's see what we can do to bring him out. 
Oh, actually, this could be avoidable. Oh, yeah, it's definitely avoidable. I guess I didn't practice it properly. Oops. Both of you. No, 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 no. Mm-hmm. This is the point. If it was a Let's Play, I'd be cutting this encounter away, but we, we're streaming, so let's just run. Okay, come a little closer again, please. Or come a little bit closer, right over here. There you go. Come on, like a matador. No, no, get back here. I want my 10k. <laughs> darn it, I have to like leave and return. Turn around. You see me? Oh, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. I'm not doing this as well as I would like to. I need that 10,000 gold. I need that 10,000 gold. All right, let's try this again, round two. All right, get back here. All right, all right. Now let's use a holy bottle and sneak on by. There you go. Okay. Let's beat this little fake up. Uh, I'm gonna do it. What is this cup here? Okay, okay. Uh, magic lands. Let's keep it going. Bring around a rosy. Get ourselves our burst art. <laughs> Pocket full of posies. Oops, did I do the wrong thing? Yeah, I totally did. Where's the repeat? Because I don't want to. Whoa! You know, we talk about Yuri like uh, practicing for his baseball career. Carol here practicing for his golfing career. <laughs> And I'm just practicing for the marathon, like a like a running marathon for dogs. Actually, this enemy isn't really that strong. I was too scarred by that other by that other uh, fake we saw at that mountain. Uh, F O R E. Yeah, that's definitely four. All right, 10k gold, very nice. Sneak up by here, pick up a good weapon for repeat, Vagabond. Yeah. Item Amplifier is a big thing for him. Basically, Leia from uh, from Exilia 1. I didn't realize repeat was that character because I didn't explore this game too much, but Leia's item use is like really good. What's this? Looks like things are getting pretty crazy. The blast is out of control. <laughs> I heard you the first time, Rita. Smashing up that control panel did more damage than we thought. So, so what the hell are we gonna do about this thing? Good question. Wait. I don't think waiting is going to do us any good. No, I think I get it. Look at that. Uh, what is that? Air is being transferred at a tremendous rate. There can only be one place something this big could be sending that much power. A part on the Heracles that requires the most power. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it might stop Heracles. It finishes each other's sentences, right? Lozophia's clean off the map. No way! So what should we do? Well, whatever we do, we have to stop this air. They nomos, huh? Ah, uh, yes. Oh, yeah. This That's little thing has all the power to do everything. Control. Good old Dane Nomos and really Rizomata. I don't really have a choice. Here goes nothing. All right. Let's clear it up. I think we got our holy bottle here, so we should be fine to sneak in. Pick up a uh, pick up one lemon gel. And see the crystal. Oh, so they're using. Okay, now I get why. Okay. Thanks for thanks for your uh, astute observation there, Patty. Are we gonna break it? Like one of the Entelikea souls, right? Great, that's what it's down to. Yeah. Keeps going. We can kiss Sapphias goodbye. This kind of makes me wonder about something for like later on in the game, which we'll be running into for sure. But um, I'll get to it once we get there, if I remember, of course. But I'm pretty sure you all know what I'm thinking about. Thank you. 
Alexei? Huh? <laughs> <Stop>. <laughs> Why did that really sound like Alexei right there? <laughs> I, <laughs> did they really voice? Wait, huh? We shut the power. Oh wait, I'm stupid. It sets off the it sets off the cannon. Maybe that's why he said thank you or something. I don't know. Maybe I wasn't paying attention, but I thought that was a stall that said it. Wasn't it a stall? Pretty sure it was a stall, right? How are we gonna change the trajectory of a cannon? Ram into it with a freaking boat. <laughs> Let's go all out. Jeez, that, you, know, you never realize how huge that thing is until you see these CG cutscenes. Like, yeah, the dungeon is one thing. Yeah, the, the, um, what's it called? The first time you see it, it doesn't particularly emphasize the size as much, I want to say. But this cutscene is when you know. It's when you know it's really huge. Jeez, look at that explosion. <laughs> Dramatic slow mo. I was really worried there for a second. That's some friend you have. <laughs> there he goes again, showing off as usual. That line, I think, has more weight if he wasn't in our one party earlier. Voice when you cut the apatheia? No. That might have See, been the voice of whatever Antelakea used to Wasn't that be. supposed to be a stall? It was like or am I am I crazy? It, it might have been a different be different Antelakea altogether. I guess it wasn't really fully confirmed to be I a stall. But it's, you know, but it really sounded like Alexei. <laughs> uh, it's like, does Alexei have an intercom system all of a sudden? We've lost too much time getting sucked into this Heracles decoy business. I agree. Let's hurry. <laughs> I 100% agree, Raven. Let's keep on pushing forward. But granted, this does give Rita a bit of an idea. The Rizomata formula and Estelle. She's keeping this all in her head, mind you. This this child genius keeping all this stuff in her head. She knows. She knows what she's cooking up. <laughs> they discussed hearing it in the skit, but we're not doing those. Okay. Oh, oh, shoot. I forgot you skip like the whole camera pan if you just mash X. I completely forgot about that. Uh, they discuss hearing in a skit, but we're not doing those. So, like, what skit was it then? Because the only skit I got is we're talking about Carol's bag, part two. We didn't even hear about the first part. All right, time for us to get out of here. Is Flynn? Down there? The fleet looks like it's in trouble. Oh no! This is not good. Judging from the tilt, those ships are taking on water. Finally! <laughs> they don't pick up the They're gonna sink! Isn't that Flynn yelling down there? Doesn't look like there's any way to A bit of dialogue that, that felt like it had more of a contribution. Thank you, Patty. I feel bad for doing this to Flynn, but we really need to get going. Are you sure? You're gonna get an earful later. I'm used to his lectures. Judy, take us out of here. <laughs> That's good. I'm used to it. Have you <laughs> have you seen Act Two? Baul, head towards the capital. I also keep underestimating how big yeah. Baul is sometimes. Storm would have one other cutscene where he's just yeah. like lying there with the reveal that he he's evolved to and to like a level. Why is he so big compared to the others? I guess that's his type of Antelike, I suppose. I mean, Pharaoh's kind of big too. I I guess, I guess like I'm just think. I'm only thinking about Bellius. Bellius doesn't seem as big as the other ones, I suppose. There it is. It's the capital. Huh? Whoa! No more barrier. I wonder if this is Alexei's doing. Yeah, Astal was pretty small too. That guy's just doing whatever he wants. I guess it just it, it's just Ready variant, I suppose. Take us there. Could you be? Where do we even start looking in a city this big? Maybe it could be an environmental thing. I we I can see the it. Airflow. If Alexei is using Estelle and Apatheia in his plans, 
It has to cause a disturbance in the air. Baul! Let's go, Baul. Let's do this thing. All right, it's time to confront Alexei. We've been waiting for this moment. Yes. Estelle. We needed somebody to point since Estelle's not in our party anymore. All right. This should have been a shooting mini game too, like like a like a shoot 'em shoot 'em up. Yeah, shoot 'em up. The Apathea just floating around her. Oh gee, she looks really out of it too. Man, Alexei's such a jerk. This guy's a big jerk. Come on, Bowl, you got this. <laughs> she certainly has her uh, her uh, lawyer finger ready to go. Nah, she's part-time lawyer. We know she'd be a part of uh, Right and Co. Is it me? Like, I know the movie audio is quiet, but there's no way to adjust that, right? I've been wondering how to adjust this, but I don't think there's any way to do it. All these cutscene audio, they keep making it quiet, I guess, in this game. <laughs> what is this, Dragon Ball Z? <laughs> Grunt before you jump. Which, I, I, I know is a thing for, like, some scenarios in anime, but... It, it's, a, it's certainly an anime thing, that's for sure. <laughs> Holy smokes, Yuri. Holy smokes, Yuri. You were lucky that was there. At that moment. Estelle. Please, I beg of you. Before I cause anyone any more pain. She's very genuinely sad. See, again, I'm not as hard as her on her as I was last time. But why? Why were we there back to back? Oh, uh, man, this is Zafia's. This entire scenario. That smirk! That smirk in anime form! <laughs> He's like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Alexei. Why is your face way too. Um, oh, I guess, for lack of a better term, why is it way too mimetic? It's so, it's so much, so many moments where, like, he really goes, he really turns on the ham dial the moment he gets the apathea. Oh, I'm alive. Oh. He he made armor that doesn't have a hinge. Oh, is that the case? All right, Did I get it. Make it. Like I believe that if that was a thing. I'll be all right. Oh. Oh, I'm alive, but I can't say much more than that. Feels like I might have snapped a few bones. This ship's a mess, too. You won't get away with this, Alexei. Ow, ow, ow. Yuri, it hurts. So, we got a bit of a detour to make. We're not confronting Alexei just yet. I feel like almost every single time almost. that I look at this game again, like, I thought, oh, we're gonna go through Alexei, but then, oh, wait, I forgot about once. something that happens before here, because they need to expand on the game a Don't bit. Don't try to talk. We're gonna get you both to a doctor. Try and hang in there for a little longer. Because we could have just gone here and there, but, Thank oh, you, well. old friend. We owe you so much. I'm guessing there's more in side quests that explores a bit about, like, their relations between, between Judy and Baul, because from what I get here, it's like, it's okay, great war, but then there wasn't really much further that was elaborated on that. For us than we could ask. Take care and rest well. This thing is still so huge, he's clipping through the tree. <laughs> Baul, <laughs> his model is so gigantic. The great Antelakea. Trees mean nothing to him. Could have sworn there was a skit discussing the Apathea. Eh, eh, don't worry about it if you can't find it, it's fine. Yeah, if we don't hurry. There's a whole novel that explains how Judy You've met Baul and her backstory, but it's Japan only. Yeah. A lot of stuff is Japan only. I, if we go after Alexei like this, we're sure to get our butts handed My guess is that he's probably flying off to Mount Temza. 
It seems we're somewhere near Kapu Noor. Let's go to Nobody's Nova gonna Harbor. disturb him there There's anyway, so it makes sense. There. Yeah. I don't like that sky. The air is boiling like thunderclouds. There's a mean storm brewing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he needs to recharge his batteries at Mount Temza. <laughs> I believe it. What the heck is going on? Is this a sign we're about to get hit with some kind of disaster? I just that's finished a, building I'll my house for <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> Man, that's, that is a big mood right there. I just finished building my house. Come on. And then now the world is going to end. Oh, oh, that's a little bit too relatable. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That uh, uh, Maybe not as funny as I thought it would be. Where did you come from? Did you hear anything? No, we were... Arc 3 is really short, yeah. Compared to Arc 2, Arc 3 is really, really short. You look terrible. What happened to you? <laughs> you know what I also like doing? Um, when, it, when it gets to that line with Teagle, I like to give everybody uh, different costumes. It's like, you look terrible. Well, you have bad fashion statements. Well, do you think you might be able to bring the doc to the inn? We're too beat to even walk anymore. All right, I'll be back soon. Oh, and they did have one small Thank little dungeon so much, in Act Doctor. Three, for the definitive edition, which uh, quote unquote, was more more cutscene than anything you else. From Hellier, then? And I don't mean add, more like a revisit. Yes, I still can't thank you enough for your help before. Oh, hello there. Are you with them too? I. What? Do you know them? I mean, she was here. After I got Polly back to his home, they let me sleep over and eat with them. Oh, right. After you left Rago's palace. Oh, yeah. They did give Yuri, Asha, and Flynn, now Luke. That a new I don't know how to feel about that one. I kind of get what they're going with, Nora but I don't think it don't fit as well, because they live. both have two very but different now, dynamics going on here. It is. Hey, mister. Hey, mister. Did you hear it? There like, I appreciate that they shout out to the to Luke and Ash, but and it don't particularly work like if we're thinking about the personalities. A town official is currently going to see what happened. Hey, Where's that nice lady who was with you? Is she gone? Uh... Now that I think of it, that girl would have been able to heal your wounds. What happened to her? Oh, you know what? They're very astute for NPCs. A certain worthless idiot handed her over to the bad guy. Now we're chasing after them. <laughs> I see. I guess I shouldn't have asked. I'm sorry, but she's away for today. Oh, really? Don't worry. The next time we come, we'll bring her with us for sure. Really? Yay! <laughs> Jump for, for joy, now, Polly. We'll bring her back rest. to you, but I don't think we ever really interact with them again after this. Uh, I think we just gotta go outside a little bit. Because we got to meet up with a certain individual. Your Excellency, it's horrible. The road, the road, it's gone. <laughs> There's a giant hole on the other side of a meat Well, this hill. stinks. It's burning Never thought I'd say I miss, I miss Emmett Hill, but what? this is certainly a case. Like that. I suppose that's what all that rumbling was earlier. Even if we were able to get near that hole, getting across it would be impossible. No one will be able to go past a meat hill like this. So then, Nor is cut off from everyone else? Unfortunately, it this is. is. This is real bad. Could this be the blast from the Heracles cannon? Yeah, I was wondering about Emmett Hill at first, but then I realized, oh yeah, the cannon. The cannon's trajectory was uh, changed. Well, it's either Emmett Hill or Zafia's. Zafia's would be a game over for sure. Anybody. Don't matter who you talk to. So it did end up hitting. Rita and Kira are still knocked all. out though. Thankfully it missed hitting any of the towns. You guys sure you're alright? No, I heard all over, but Estelle's in trouble. I can't just lie around. I like how Yeah, what he said. Um 
this is actually time sensitive where we can't they tank they can't technically rest in an inn like narrative wise but i think after this battle we could rest very fine afterwards i'm afraid not a little or like we could like go outside and sleep in a tent same effect long trip Guys, I don't think we need to heal anyway, because like we're going to be running to a like a heal save point soon How about anyway. the Fiertia and heading round by sea. The keel's all smashed up, so it'll take a while to fix it. Damn, at a time like this. Then two dungeons, then cutscenes. Well, there is one way, but I'm just not sure how I feel about recommending it to you. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got it. If it'll get us through, let's hear it. Again, Act Three is very much shorter than um. Act two. I'm afraid it'll end up taking you a for main narrative wise. For side quest wise, everything opens up, which kind of reminds me because like I feel like they really started making it a thing after Tales of Destiny two. Um, something when I realized when I played Tales of Destiny two two years ago, I noticed that like a lot of traditions for the Tales series really started with that game lucky, you be because be um, there were a lot of skills that were implemented first off. Um, there were so like words, art extensions. There, there were the um, <laughs> narrative wise, I want to say it's um, it's more personal because like the three games prior that. to well, fishermen. okay, personal because is a bit of a subjective term. Um, there's more. You're also gambling on oh, here. what are the words I'm looking for? So it's more no like of uh, sacrifice of stakes. I want to say. Nature, after all, more sacrifice more of stakes in Destiny 2. Yeah, there's some boss gimmicks here or there. Um, Quite the keen observation. Uh, narrative wise as well, there's like a there's like a kind of third act way, where you can explore we'll and do it. side quests, quote unquote. Um, okay, let's do it. There's there's a lot Thanks to Destiny 2 help. that set things up, which I thought Symphonia set least up. I can do. There wouldn't be much left of this family if it weren't for you all. Only thing I'll ask First, you use over, over limit two. Boy. Yeah, uh, they weren't even called over limits. They're called like Spirit Blaster at the time. And um, first one to really use, uh, you need to be in Spirit Blaster to use your uh, your Mystic Guard. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Like, there's a lot of firsts that that game did for the series. It was really cool to experience. Uh, narrative themes too, for that matter. Um, but I, <laughs> I, I want to say Destiny Two is like my favorite se sequel of the entire franchise. That's for sure. Um, it has something for like old fans and new fans to, to sink their teeth into. And it does make me hope that someday people will be able to play it through a patch or something along those lines. Milk, apples, peaches. Yeah, I think we're kind of low on the fruit side of things. Uh, okay, I think we're good. Do we get any new items from that uh, Zoggy fight? We got a poison charm and a dark seal. Wow, thanks, Zoggy. Uh, yeah, there's not much we could really need here. Those first, yeah, those first ones we have those uh, skit style. That skit style, bleh, that skit style too. Like you, you see in Graces, um, you see in Rebirth. Rebirths were more animated than Destiny too. That's for sure. Um, but yeah, it does a lot of firsts in the series, which it kind of it all. It's also technically the first one to not really have like a. It's like a pseudo chain capacity thing. Like, there's still TP, but, like, the whole thing with that game is, like, you alternate between, um, you alternate between physical attacks and spells. Because every character in that game can cast spells, too. And have, uh, attack guards as well. Like, there were a lot of things Destiny 2 started off. Yeah, they all have their hybrid characters that can potentially do melee. Like, people would kind of associate Abyss being the first one, but no, it started off with Destiny 2. Like, it's not the best, but every character has to, like, balance their um, spell use with attack output. Because, like, if you don't balance out your attack output, then you're going to constantly run out of tech... Not technique points. Uh, what's it called there? I forgot what it was. Spirit gauge? Yeah, your spirit gauge will run low and you'll, uh... <laughs> and you'll, you will be staggered for a bit because you overabused your spirit gauge.
Uh, we're getting close to a boss that I'm not particularly looking forward to. I guess not quite it's what you're thinking. Cold. So very cold. Okay, old man, we get it already. Really don't like that chill, does he? The aged have lower body temperatures, you know. Uh, but I wouldn't care for the heat of that desert. To be fair, he was having a lot of fun in the desert. You're gonna slip and fall if you don't shut up. Oops, too late. Tch. Watch it there. We old folks are fragile. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Not a bad delivery. Man, this is really some place. Sort of a cross between mysterious and just plain creepy. There are swords coming up out of the ice. Didn't Patty have an explanation for this? They seem to be all over. Just what kind of place? They is give her this? something to do here. They're relics of a battle that happened long ago between pirates and the Empire. Was this actually a thing in 360? Or who does somebody explain that in 360? <laughs> pirates against the Empire? It's stuff that I picked up when I was researching about Or were they just random swords there that we never really had a reasoning to it? Got its name from the sharp cold, but I guess I was wrong. I don't think you were too far off with cold as a void. <laughs> oh, I just guess for cooking hot food in the desert and cold food in the <laughs> in Zophir. What's wrong with him? Ah! Whoa. Huh? What was that? It's big. <laughs> oh, it's Is that gets. an Entelikea? No, I don't sense intelligence in it. So the legit so a monster, right? ice monster it's beast. Trouble if that thing attacked us. It's a bite of Joe. How do you know? Well, I, I, I guess because of the pirates. Yeah, all right. I mean, that was kind of contrib contributionary. I don't even know that's a word, but I made it up. All right. This dungeon had, well, we did point out that there were, like, swords on the ground and whatnot, but there's a lot of nice little weapons we can pick up here. Uh, who was my party for this? Uh, oh, yeah, we definitely need, uh, uh, we need you, we need you, and Rita can stay. Uh, let's see here. Did our holy bottle just run out? Oh, it did. did it. Okay. Might as well use it now, because it's going to screw up the layout. I'm going to miss Vesperia holy bottles. <laughs> if that's one thing I'm definitely going to miss uh, after playing Vesperia, their holy bottles are like the best in the series. You're practically invisible. And you cause everybody else to freeze as well. It looks like he's taken a liking to us. I prefer dates who are a little less aggressive. I wonder if we can catch it somehow. You want to eat it or something? Cold water fish have more fat to insulate their bodies from the low temperatures, making them oh so delicious. White meat is just I'm craving salmon. Skewers. Even though it isn't white meat. Uh, Anywho. That's not a fish, you know. That thing's a monster. Raw salmon, I mean to say. Do you not have holy bottles in dawn? I I didn't even notice you didn't have holy bottles in dawn. Oh no. If dawn had won, what would I have done? I have no idea. <laughs> Jeez, I'm really craving sushi. Darn it! Why'd you have to bring up the the value of eating fish? I want some omega threes right here, right now. Uh, Dawn the New World's battle theme? Uh, it's not bad. I like the Final Dungeon battle theme. That one's a little bit underrated, but, um, otherwise, I, I, uh, I think their battle themes are okay. I swear if you like it, though. More power to you. I'm all about the Tales of Destiny 2 soundtrack. Those battle themes are good. Uh, same with some of Roberts as well. <laughs> Um, Arise yeah, does have some, uh, interesting ones so that I'm curious salty, to hear about. So cold. 
You sure are energetic, old The man. Dreadnought is a really good boss team. If we just um, talking, and I like, uh, I mean, theme of battle is, yeah, everybody talks about it, but I like, uh, Dona Nobis Pachem. That one is really good. I think I put it as, like, top one as my favorite normal battle themes. It's frozen! How annoying. Alright. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, there's a lot of good treasures that we're picking up here. Did I equip Carol's? Yeah, because we got Guard Arts and Burst Guard finally for Carol. <laughs> As we keep on progressing forward here. Hades. That's a game that I'm going to play someday, because I've heard really good things about it. Um, it's on the Game Pass, so I'm definitely going to give it a try someday. But yeah, this, art, uh, this weapon will also give us our... Um, Mystic Guard for Judith as well. I was going to say Judith for a second there, since we're just talking about uh, <laughs> Destiny 2. Um, did I get it all? Elemental? Oh, and I'm missing Anti-Element. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of weapons i got to, like, retrack, retrace during the break. Because I thought I'd still be able to keep up with it with my spreadsheet, but uh, spreadsheet ain't really out. <laughs> Helping at the end of the day, but oh well. It, it is it is doing its best, basically. I know some people don't like Game Pass. Um, I'm o I I'm okay with it because like I I grew up with like renting stuff back in the day, so this is, like as much of an equivalent to renting as I'm gonna get. Um, because I already have too many games in my backlog. I don't think I can afford to spend any more games anymore. I'd rather just, like, have them on a rental. But that's just my, my perspective, at least. Oh, yeah, that's a good, good point. Vesperia is on Game Pass right now, if you want to try it. Um, I'm actually <laughs> gonna do another Vesperia playthrough after the marathon <laughs> for some friends. <laughs> Which is okay, because we're, we're getting to a point where, like, um, I need to skip some things, but uh, it, it, it shouldn't be so bad. I'm, I'm not going to be, like, as worried about, like, oh, there's a deadline, there's a deadline. Nah, that's going to be more lax. Uh, backstep, Super Chain 4, uh, what else we got here? Lucky Soul? Did I? Oh, no, I didn't equip Lucky Soul yet. weird. That monster seems to have times when it bothers us, and times when it leaves us alone. I agree, Judith. Yeah, I don't like it one bit. <laughs> we stand Not on one thick bit. Ice. I don't think that we need to worry about being attacked. If that thing comes at us, we can just kick its butt. Bring it that's on! Uh, that's fair, uh, Planetario. I'd really prefer not fighting something like that head-on at the moment. Let's get back to land as soon as we can. And back to someplace warm. <laughs> oh, Raven. Um, I wonder how far we're gonna go. Cutscenes are definitely gonna be an issue. Maybe we could finish the dungeon after this. We'll see. We'll see if we can finish the dungeon after this before break time. And I might be going backwards. No, I'm going forwards. This turtle. Not a threat. Uh, guys, there's a diamond guard. Let's pop that onto Raven over here. Very nice. And we really, like, holy smokes, I am making so much money right now that I don't feel like I have to worry about money anymore. Well, actually, money may become a bit of an issue at the very end of the game, but we'll get to that once we get there. Okay, I think we should be ready for this, I hope. Time for this. <clears throat> time for this boss. It's one of those scenarios that. Oh. This will make good practice. Let's just get it. No, it wouldn't. Let's just run. Yep. Yeah, I agree, Raven. Let's just get this over with. Don't use TP. Don't use TP. 
thank you. They actually didn't use KP. Wow. That rarely happens. All right. So, you know the thing I was talking about before? It's like, oh, what if, like, you use... You have the narrative let you use, like, different party members or whatnot. This one does scenarios, too. So, I'm happy that this happens, personally. But I know... I know some people may not like it if you're playing as uh, the lead character a lot, it's which I understand. It's a good thing that we go through here too, because you kind of learn. This this place definitely becomes essential later on. Everyone be on your guard. Oh, man. But this there boss right here, man. this boss right here. We're up on this rock, right? We'll be fine. Raven, you're tempting fate. Thank you. Destroyed you the first time you played it? Yeah, it kind of destroyed me too a little bit. Like, because I was not used to playing as Carol as, at all. <laughs> rolling Revolution! Every single time I see Carol rolling off like that. Rolling Revolution! <laughs> How's it going, Omega? How could I have been so careless? I should have known. Man, stop bringing up sushi. I'm I'm really craving sushi right now, but I actually do have some salmon right beside me, so it's perfect timing. <laughs> I have salmon. I am ready to eat salmon during my break. <laughs> I'm ready for this. Oh, Jesse, watch Yuri. We can do this. The thing is, I never realized, I don't re fully understand the consistency of moving past this point. Like, I'm pretty sure there may be some people here you might all know, but I, uh, I never really figured it out. So if anybody knows exactly what you're supposed to do, educate me, I suppose, if you want. But I, <laughs> the stamp, I love the stamp <laughs> right there, that's a perfect view, perfect perspective. Oh, this song again. What's the last time we heard this song? Oh yeah, we heard it when when uh, Schwan did the thing, which was the answer to the question, by the way. <gasps> yeah! I will stamp all the mails and documents I can find on Notary's dream. Uh, okay. Give this a scan. Found that salmon good? Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Do your thing. <laughs> Good start. Good start. Keep on running, Carol. Get in the way. Water prank. Ah! Not from behind. First two triggers are HP based, last is timer triggered. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I was just always confused about this each time I did it. Uh, where's my nice ace smash? Oh! <laughs> That's definitely HP based. <laughs> Didn't even give me a chance to run. Come on! <laughs> did not give me a chance to run at all. <laughs> Alright, I don't want that to happen again. Alright, that. <laughs> Jeez, Carol. Couldn't even. Didn't even give me a chance to run this by to Joe, according to Patty. You one-shot him during the Carol part? That's a good... I, I think it might just be like one of those cases where the cutscene just moves forward. You can just run out around until it times out? Oh, okay. I don't know, because like sometimes like when I ran around like this, nothing happened. And I'm like, am I doing something wrong? So you could just like run around in circles then. Okay. No more running. I don't know if it's like a like a placebo sort of thing, cause like when when Carol gets his skill where he like stands up, um, I feel like there's a difference. But apparently people, I I didn't look into it too much, but people suggested, oh, um, the stance change doesn't really change too much at all. I'm fine. You most certainly are not. No, it's all right. You guys are all here with me. Yeah, Carol, friendship. People keep bragging on friendship. Come on. So no matter how bad I'm beat up, I can't lose. Move, damn it. 
If you don't, the kid's gonna... You got this. You got this, Mini Lloyd. There's your sword. Pick it up. Become the Arthur that you want to be. Savage Wolf Fury. Let's go. Oh, actually, you know what? I do like what happens in this cutscene, though. Of <laughs> the slow motion is, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, this is a little bit much. Oh, no, it only shows Yuri's reaction. I thought it'd show everybody else. Oh! Rolling revolution in the air. This is this is admittedly kind of cool. How did he? You're mine. Yeah, that's like a that's like a link down down stab right there. Soul Calibur two, a rising falcon. Yeah, that works. Tempest. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Both of those work too. <laughs> Yo, you look at Carol with that stance. I want that stance instead. <laughs> that would look so much better. We should have got that stance, but it would have changed his uh, battle style so much. Of course. All right, let's pay this guy back double for all those knocks you took. All right, let's do this. Okay, Bido Joe, the actual fight. Um, what do I normally? Uh, I just have her use Violent Pain and Ground Dasher anyway. Uh, Raven shouldn't have his arts where he like runs up to them. I think Falling is one of them. Oh, he has Azure of Heavens. That's perfect. I think Heavens here does it too. Uh, same with Violet Snake for some weird reason. Um, but anyway, let's go. After I use the magic ones. Okay, let's see what we got here. Charge up an attack. Keep it forward. Yeah, billboard to the very end. So does this so does this stance actually change anything? The motion change? Like again, I feel like it may be placebo. It kind of feels like it for me, but I don't know if uh, anybody truly knows if it doesn't. I, I read that it doesn't, but I don't know. I just feel the power of Carol just by staring at him move like this. Oh, I don't work. But yeah, it's gonna be another one of those fights where it's just uh, nothing but a meat shield. Just keep hitting it over and over again. And I used the wrong art. Um, I pressed the wrong button. Did I change his arts recently? Oh, I did. Okay. Uh, where did I put a uh, Reaper knock? There it is. Did he learn anything? Ooh, Devil Rage Rise. Yeah, that that. I'm gonna need to equip that. Uh, the fish is called Baito Joe. But ever, ooh, nice stun. But ever since, like, um, Patty, like, mentioned, uh, mentioned, uh, fish and raw fish and the taste of the fish, I'm now craving fish. Secret mission is also really easy for this, too. If only could get close to do something. Oh, I still want to play as Carol. This is Carol's time to shine. Patty confirmed it with PS3. Fair enough. Four. I still can't believe that fake went all the way up in the air there. I've ne I don't think I've ever seen that with Carol. Maybe he is known for it, but I never noticed it. Alright, way, way to go, Rita, with the timing on that violent pain. That was really good timing, holy smokes. Oh jeez. <laughs> that was a bit of a <laughs> that was a bit of a reaction. Boom. Yeah, he went with that with, with that Zelda finishing uh, slash there too. Link, Link slash Link from the game of Zelda. You know what I mean? Oh. All right, give me a bit too much TV there. Did I- does he still have the emerald ring I gave him? I think he still does. Yeah, okay, cool. 
how big that that spider web is on on Baito Jojo. Four ah, that's some damage. Wait, what the? Don't I have anything mapped there? I could have had something mapped. Oi, 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 oi! Recover, recover! No, no, six. Okay, took five, took five attempts, but we got it. Uh, four, or spider web. Darn it! Um, I'm overestimating uh Carol's range. Try again. Nope. Man, I'm so glad Raven has Azure Heaven. <laughs> that's gonna be really useful later on, that's for sure. Okay. Alright, come on. Let's keep beating up the, the sushi here. Ground some ground some uh salmon, as uh, we all talked about here. Alright, it's at the halfway point, so this should just keep going fine. We do one of these. Oops, not one of those. One of these. Keep it going. Yeah, speed it up a little bit more. Let's use more of our OVLs. Just a little bit. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Getting too greedy. Getting way too greedy. Oh, oh, Judy. Oh, Judy, no. Ah! I got way too greedy and way too greedy. Okay. Oh, I would love some sashimi right now. Holy smokes. Sashimi is even more of a crate, but it's way too expensive. Did you see Judy's HP? She was at like 12. She barely made it. She barely made it. She almost died. She almost died. Going. Judy's like my backup here. We got this. We got this. Ow. Oh no. Ray uh Carol. Didn't block in time. Couldn't run away in time. Thank you. Alright. Does whatever a spider can, baby. Let's go. 14k on a FS. Carol, you're such a powerhouse. Oh, jeez. Oh, Raven, I'll save you. No, no need for that. I can save him. That's my role. It's my role as Carol the healer. And I'll heal him too. Two for one, two for one. Okay, now you can use your items. Let me, let me do my thing first. Because <laughs> sometimes during my practice, I keep forgetting, why are my party members dying like Judy right there? <laughs> because I don't heal them fast enough. Raven and I aren't quite there yet, but we're trying. We're trying our best. Oh, that's the thing, like, when I do the cancel with, like, Carol, I don't, like, 100%, like, get him out of it to use another destruction treat. Oh, boy. Alright, four. Uh, still too far. Four. <laughs> Slow down. Four again. Happy Gilmore. Bob Barker. I don't know what else to reference here. That's really old golf references. <laughs> Recover. All right. Ah! Pain and misery. Leave Rita alone. What has she ever done to you? Besides, caps a lot of violent pain. Oh, of course. When you first played Vesperia, oh, everybody hated this one. Especially because, like, uh, I mean, like. As much as I said, oh, it'd be nice to play as characters that you're you're not generally used to. Like I was one of the people at the time when I first played. It's like, oh, I didn't like playing as Carol, but I eventually warmed up to him, as you can see. <laughs> yeah, yo, I liked a little bit of silence right before, like, drag it up for her. <laughs> Do it again. All right. Uh, what am I missing here? I guess I'm missing a bit of a coil piece. Huh? Sorry, I saw the violent pain. I sorry, sorry. Sometimes when I see a violent pain, I sometimes think that it's going for me. Call it a bit of a 
uh, a reflex, essentially. Okay. Four. I don't know what to say. It's a hole in ten. Alright. Yeah, again, a lot of these boss fights for Act 2 near the end of this point, at this point, it's like, they're not really hard, it's just really long, because they're all beef sticks. Uh, even with the 10 times EXP, they're all beef sticks. You just gotta make sure that you keep reviving your, blah, 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 blah. You keep reviving your party members, make sure they don't die. Sushi sticks. Sashimi. All that stuff. <laughs> That's a good line from Raven every single time I hear it. It's also really good, like, for this fight with Carol. Carol's really short, so a lot of his, like, aerial attacks, like, it kind of doesn't really reach it sometimes. 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 Depending on your distance. And the cool thing about its overlimit, this guy, is that, like, if it uh, goes on the ground, then it's gonna lose its overlimit most likely. But it's kind of bad for Carol. Yeah, but it's his time to shine. This is his time to shine. And hey, I got Judy and Raven and Rita to back me up here, so it's not just Carol. A lot of aerial fights aren't really good for like characters like uh, Karen. Well, especially Carol. Yuri a little bit too. Her Pete can kind of work around it. Rita's good for like every boss. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can't think of one where Rita's not good, but I don't want to constantly keep having Rita in my party, basically. Yeah! That's, that's the spirit, Carol. Can we learn Destruction Street yet? How many usages do we get on it? Oh, we're so close. We're so close. Lock it up. I couldn't even see what happened, but thanks, Rita. Thanks, Rita. Yeah, I know he gets Tiger Blade, but I never, I never got Tiger Blade for Yuri in my life. Had Rita in my whole game, because, yeah, I agree, because Rita, like, she's, she's a powerhouse. Idiot! What were you thinking, doing that alone? Can you imagine if I didn't go overtime yesterday? We wouldn't be here. We wouldn't be here in the game. We would be really far behind. I think we'd still be going into Bakshian at this point. He's alright. Once he calmed down, it all went out of him. He's just passed out. <sighs> this kid. What if you checked out before we even rescued Estelle? Cut him a little slack now. Facing down challenges like that is part of. I wonder if we could get the uh, next dungeon done the before the break. I I don't have any scheduled guests for today. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna be full transparent right now. I don't have any scheduled guests for today. So I'm not really worried on a time sensitive sort of thing Facing today this time around. Challenges. Exactly. Those times when you just know you can't turn tail. So if 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 Hell, the next dungeon isn't gonna give me any trouble, then I think we should be in a good pace. For cutscene percent, of course. Carol's there there are a couple more cutscenes to go <laughs> later. <laughs> and I don't want to call myself a speedrunner. I'm not a speedrunner at all. I'm just playing boss. the games for fun. That was very impressive. And now it's Carol's time to shine. There's still some more Carol goodness later on, though, that's for sure. That is definitely for sure. But let's, uh, walk back here. Get ourselves a nice little heal, and then we'll push on forward. I really love this place because it gives me a lot of weapons. <laughs> a lot of good weapons that you can equip and everything. Like, you don't have to, like, spend money on them or anything at all. Like, it's it's... Perfect. This is the perfect place to get like your preparation equipment-wise a little bit, and uh, gather up some gear that you could use to not get your not only just get your skills, but you could also sell off as well. So it's uh this is a magical it's a winter wonderland of weapons. I'd like to say we're already in Act Three. We're not quite in Act Three, but we're getting close. We're getting close. This is still Act 2, I like to say. Again, Act 2 is extremely, extremely long. Second- Oh, is this the weapon? No. Oh, wait, no, it is! It is! She gets it. She finally gets it. Special. Yeah, both- Both Judy's and, uh, uh... Rita's weapons for their MAs are right here. They're all here. Alright, 
think this is ooh, oh, a lot of. <laughs> I remember back in the day, I made a lot of lottery jobs just for marathon fun. Um, unfortunately, because I'm not doing encounters in this playthrough, I can't craft as many lottery gels anymore. I miss lottery gels, though. <laughs> They're stupid fun. They they were our patty before patty became a thing. Judith, be a dear and take him for a spell. Oh, I wouldn't dream of stealing your job from you. Patty the lottery gel. Yeah, she's the she's the personification of a lottery gel. <laughs> In battle and everything. Well, Carol, you're really good at pretending to be asleep. Forcing a poor old man to work in this cold. Mr. Carol, you're made of tougher stuff than I might have guessed. <laughs> oh, Carol. Feeling better, Carol? Yeah. We were really worried about <laughs> I like I like the fist pump with that with that line too. Me too. You didn't look that worried to me. Really? That's weird. <laughs> Patty's Just a lottery never do job. That again, yeah. Okay? We're all in this together. Okay. Ooh, I had to hold myself back from making a very so dated funny. reference, but <laughs> Oof, that was a little bit that was a little bit close considering when this game came out. It would have been not as relevant, but still a little bit as today, that's for sure. Take care of your friends and they'll be there when you need them. Was that it? Yeah. I was thinking maybe this is the kind of thing he meant. Oh yeah, I forgot that Don said that. Well, if you feel like you understand what he said, I'm sure you're on the right track. I hope so. All right, the exit's right in front of us. Let's go. Ah, uh, yes. Everything okay, right? I really have to fix up my skills like during the break or two. Like yeah. I really have to I was just put them on the spreadsheet or something. The ice here was made by the air. Just to make sure everything's correct, because I think I I hope the we're gonna get our party back air? together again after before the break. Well, if all things are made up of air, that would make sense. By this phase, we might be able to though, to be honest. The air here was and once again, like the only reason why I'm really worried about timing is because. Again, Vesperia Maybe on itself, on its own two legs in the 360, is a really, solid, really, really long game. Things. Like, I would like to say it's like Maybe on the same level like of Abyss in this lane. Maybe slightly longer. Uh, we're having no room for error with sure. make the marathon go four days. Like, as we, for those who are back in marathon stream too, you know how long Abyss took. Took super, sure super long. Awesome um. But then Definitive Edition adds even more cutscenes, so, so it makes it ten times, not not ten times, it's an over-exaggeration. Over no, it's more like it makes a long game even longer. So that's why Room yeah, for Error, such as like, as it is. Uh, go. Lost Time, got in for like technical difficulties or things like that, Estelle, um, it okay. can really, really hurt. <sighs> it's all just from a cutscene perspective, of course. <laughs> sure thing. And I, I don't know, at the end of the day, like, uh, I'm just, eh, about, um, Vesperia's narrative. I mean, it's there, it's okay, it's not amazing, it's not terrible. This game, I still give it, like, a 3 out of 5 for me, but maybe on the higher end of 3 out of 5, if that makes sense. Like, when I say 3 out of 5, that, when I say 3 out of 5, it's like, there's nothing terrible, there's nothing particularly amazing for me. That's usually how I, um, would rate my games, um... One out of five means that I can't play it at all, like, I, I just can't. Two out of five means, like, I mean, there are some, f um, it's okay, but some, there's a flaw there that's sort of, like, affecting the experience, that intrudes on the experience. Four out of five is, like, it's, it's, re it's really good, but then, like, there's a particular flaw here or there that, like, uh, prevent, that distracts me a little bit. And, uh, five out of five is, like, oh... Even with this flaws, I love it. <laughs> like, that's pretty much, like, where I stand with my ratings, basically. So this one I give, like, a 3 out of 5 for my Tales experiences and whatnot. Um, maybe I could talk about the ratings for the other games another time, but... I think I did spend time just, like, rating all these games, like, three years ago, too. The ones that I played, at least. Yeah, today is day 3. There sure are a lot of people here. They're refugees from the capital. It's hard to believe we're in the third day. That means we're uh about 
seven days away, like a full week like from the Japanese release of Arise, if now. my math is correct. And eight days outside of Japan. <sighs> Carol, are you okay? Looks like he ain't okay at all. He's got a bad fever. He really overexerted himself. All because he had to go and be a hero. I swear. Hope they ship the Bamco store once Yuri. early. I mean, the ones from Bamco, Sorry. didn't we already get like the confirmation the emails recently? Can rest. Like, they've already confirmed that they're sent out. Like, uh, if you haven't got a confirmation email by now, I, I'd say... Oh, it's only validation of payment. I could. Have uh, I guess. Uh, I guess I might have misread it. Whoa! I didn't realize. Hello. Wait, wasn't the store named Regulus? Why is it Regulu here? Or has it always been Regulu? And I'm just crazy. Uh, actually, I should probably wait until I buy stuff. I have another chance to do so. Uh, holy bottles. Uh, we're okay for holy bottles. They haven't shipped. Okay. So then, then I might have just misread. <clears throat> I might have just misread it. No, that's fair. What? Uh, for myself, I'm just, I'm, I'm too much of a patient person. <laughs> so if I were to say, oh, it's okay, it was a couple days late. I know people really want to play games quickly, so I completely understand. Huh? Why? Probably because we don't look like we have any money. Well, you see, an important. Uh, it's, it's kind of visiting the odd, like right now, for me, because um, I'm so used to pre-ordering from like uh, like an EB Games. Well, now they're calling it GameStop Canada. I'm still not used to that. Um, but that the so this is the first time I'm like down. ordering a collector's edition straight from the Bamco website. I think it might be similar to the rest the of us too. Of it, but our business is booming thanks to all the visitors to our town. Well, it's more I took Sounds time like off from my stream. People are expecting Empire. what I scheduled. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. I hear you. I hear you. So mean you don't have any vacancies? I normally only play multiplayer games at launch. Tales is the exception. Ah, luck, ooh. That's a good point about multiplayer taken. games. Then I'll take that room, thank you. Who plays hey this there, guy? No cutting in line. Of course, I wouldn't think of not paying. I'll pay ten times the regular price. <laughs> it sounds like a voice I should know, but I, I can't quite put my finger on it. That should settle things nicely, yes? Oh, wasn't he also the guy that was at, uh, Aspio? Who was, like, uh... Who was, uh... uh what's it called? Um... Like, insulting Patty or something along those lines? Pretty sure he was. Come again. What? I knew this town Jeez. was in the sticks, but this is... Honey, let's just go on to Heliord from Nor Harbor. Oh, good well idea. Said. I should be thankful we don't Hope they're ready for a, a for a blizzard. Like this. They're gonna be in for a nasty surprise when they try to go to Port Nor. <laughs> Sorry to have kept you waiting. Your room is upstairs, in front. What? But you said there weren't any vacancies. Business is business, right? You're worried about a rise? Well, I mean, if you're money, you do what you want. About it. I can't stand people like that. Which is very understandable, and wasn't it of course. You who saved Halur's tree? This is the least I can do. I think, Enjoy like for me, thing. Tales has already gotten to the point where it's like it's the only series I'll um, particularly throw money for. Um, oh, second one being Puyo Puyo, Puyo. Um, but must be in a sorry that's pretty much it for me. I kind of want to say Kirby, but I don't what know. I didn't really like uh, Star Allies personally. Perpetrate next. It was just one bad game, though. I'm, I'm no just curious to see I'm like what they'll do after Star Allies. All the stuff he's done. Yeah, you don't want to buy something that you don't like. That's a very, very, very normal thing in life. Estelle, I want to save Estelle. Yes, but to do that, we need to take. There's care no harm of in waiting. Never any harm. And we need to come up with a better plan to do it. We can't let ourselves get blasted all the way back to Nor Harbor again. Agreed. I don't want to go through that entire sequence again. Well, we can't go anywhere till Carol gets better. So we might as well gather some info around town, don't you think? Good idea. Yeah, patience is what we gotta Someone have, basically. Might end up saying just the thing we need to hear. Wasn't the innkeeper saying that someone important from the capital was in the mayor's house? 
Let's go and have a look-see. Old man? Someone's got to look at Always be frugal with your money. Leave that to me. You kids go on ahead. I think I used the term properly. <laughs> Don't feel bad if you can't support a series if you can't support yourself first. Always support yourself. Uh Oh, there's something I'm supposed to somebody I'm supposed to talk to around here. Uh, right, I'm supposed to go all the way here. Okay. Oh, I'm so glad you are all safe. Hi, Law. Huh. You did this right. Had the inn open its rooms free of charge? And just who are you? Watch your tongue. Do you know to whom you are? Hey, <laughs> where, where, where does this guy come off? He only has one one line, and his line is like, "Oh, where do you go off, huh?" <laughs> Jeez, way to make an impression, buddy. And we don't even see him again after this. <laughs> okay, we've seen the other guy before, but we never see that guy on, on uh, Yoder's right. The capital, Zophius is no longer a city fit for any person. The city's barrier Blastia began giving off a great light, and the town was racked by earthquakes and lightning. However, oh, I guess he has more than one line, but that. still, <laughs> where do you go off? <laughs> a glowing fog appeared Jeez, that first line. Blastia and quickly spread throughout the city. The plants it touched grew hideously large, and the water became poison. It was hell itself. The air is out of control. Oh, that such dire events could befall Zophius, jewel of our glorious empire. If the air is <laughs> I like that guy city, too. What is he doing to her? The, this is that turncoat Alexei's doing. I'm sure of it. He came to us demanding our obedience. And when we refused, he swore he would reduce us to dust. Alexei? How did I get all the prizes for the giveaway? Did you have extra save for the years? Yep. They're they're all pretty much like meant for giveaways. Like um you used to be a part of Abyss of Chronicles. Uh collecting some extras here or there. Also felt like doing a little bit more because you know, I like giving back to the Tales community. Because we've all been here. No matter what year you started with Tales, we all we all here to just enjoy the series. So I thought I'd do my give back basically. Took me a while to find a PS3. Um, PS3 for Exilia, though. That's them? for sure. I'm sorry. I haven't seen anyone either. They must have been left behind with all that air flooding out. It was all we could do to save ourselves. With all that was happening, we were unable to take everyone with us. We did all we could. You must understand. Oh, you pissing Yuri off oh, yeah. again. Don't piss Yuri off. Hey. <laughs> You're lucky he's kind of reformed a bit because of the Brave Vesperia thing. Honestly, like, yeah, I, I am kind of right with that. Honestly, if it weren't for the fact that, like, Yuri, Judy, and Carol had that whole, like, guild intervention, for lack of a better term, um, I'm pretty sure Yuri would have, like, went off the spot to, like, kill somebody but he's a little bit more His level headed about it a bit a it bit it sounds like the entire capital's been covered in air and the one in the middle of it all is most likely oh no that's not a silly question at all i understand um i try to say prize pack insane. to try he to convey it better um prize pack will only go to one person that? So one person will get all of those prizes. And I especially understand considering like AC, they keep giving out a lot of giveaways for multiple people. I, uh, I'm one person. I can't, I can't, I can't have like a second, second place or a third place thing. I, I'm, I'm a, I, I don't think I could pull that off. Even if we take out Alexei, she... Do, do you think maybe there's a way to get her power under control? There is. There has to be. We just haven't found it yet. Man, I want to play Great Ace Attorney. Uh, Someday I will. I've been hmm. I've been craving an Ace Attorney hey, game for a while nice. recently because the last one I played was like uh, uh, can, Spirit of Justice. 
They don't have that was like maybe nomos. three or four years ago. Hmm. I'll try asking Pharaoh. It would be good to know how much time we have left. Though, like, <laughs> I ended up playing uh, Disco Elysium, and that kind of helped a little bit, to be honest. <sighs> to 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 satisfy the crave a bit. Yuri. Hey, did we wake you up? How are you feeling? Yeah, shipping is Looks always like going to be a thing. So again. for for those You're of you who are capital, who right? want to do future giveaways, always be mindful of shipping. Don't and always be clear that. about what We're you're going to do. Well, to do. You just get well, better. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Just be clear just about be like behind, okay? Know where you're going to send it to basically. Our whole guild is going to rescue Estelle. I know. Why don't you try and get some more sleep, huh? Okay. I can't seem to reach him. The air may be causing interference. No big deal. Does air the cause interference between Antilochia and... Yeah, that's the thing, like, Judith uses the Nagi, right. or, or whatever it is, where, like, uh, Critian can uh, communicate with, um, with Antilochia, and I think it's, like, the only time where it doesn't really work. Keep an eye on Carol for me. Maybe, maybe that's how crazy the air is in Zafia's right now. Yuri! What's with a long face? You don't need to worry about me. <laughs> Hmm. That's a transition between uh, George and Baker that I didn't mind either. A job nobody wants. To I will do. keep my own count going. <laughs> the air working like dial-up internet. Oh, everybody knows the sound effects whenever you bring up dial-up internet. Sound effect will never leave. If Are you, you heard it once, alone? you you it will be ingrained for the rest of your life. I don't think that's any of your highness's concern. I want to know how things are in the lower quarter, so I'm just going to go take a look. The council has decided to bring formal charges of criminal conspiracy against Alexei. The knights are currently forming a strategy for re-entering the capital from Dayton Hold. With all that air in the city? <laughs> I doubt they'll get very far. Estelise's is with Alexei, isn't she? How did... So you caught on, huh? I wondered why you didn't bring her up earlier. What do you intend to do about it? Well, him? he's pretty smart. He has to be smart for being mean? a royal guy, after all. All those who carry the Imperial blood possess a certain power. In most of us, it is too faint to be of use. But I have heard that hers is extraordinary. I'm sure it was for this reason that the Council threw their support behind her. Why are you bringing this up now? Isn't this current disaster being Not caused all by her royals power? Are smart. Well... That's a different kind of worm. So what if it is? I don't want to open. The knights may have to. You are aware that defeating Alexei may not be enough. That's not going to happen. Because you'll do it yourself. Flynn told me about you. Yo, Yoder. <laughs> Yo, this guy. Underrated like observations right here. You can tell him that we'll be just fine. We barely interacted with the guy too. Well, I know Flynn like filled him in, filled him in, but, but he needed to know. I thought I told you this isn't your concern. That sword. Perhaps you are just the person it was waiting for. Uh, and I'll try now you... on you. Oh, Yuri! Holy smokes! Yuri, chill! Yuri, no! Holy smokes, Yuri! <laughs> Stop threatening people like that, man. What about Brave Vesperia? You can't do this. Oh, you know what? I never. I noticed I didn't equip his new sword. I didn't equip a lot of his stuff to check his skills yet. Oh, jeez. Um. Okay. Well, first off, I guess we should start. I'm pretty sure I put Gaia Cleaver stuff on. Um. Did I? Yes, I did. Okay. So Gaia Cleaver is fine. Um. I definitely need to get the Dane Nomo stuff going. Uh. Pardon me. Special. Super Chain and Bastion. Mm -mm -mm. And then let's uh, get Combo Plus 2. Perfect. And let's just keep Dane Nomos on, because I want to feel like a king. I 
I'm going the wrong way. No, I'm going the right way. No, I'm going the wrong way. Dad, that's a, that's Emmett Hill. We can't go through Emmett Hill. Uh, here we go. And away we go. Ah, oh, good times, Repeat. If only we had our... Uh, Oh, I forgot- I keep forgetting to pick up this orange shell every single time. I'm like, remember the orange shell, and I always keep forgetting it. That would have been useful early- wait, like, two days ago. That would have been really useful. Man. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, well, at least we brought it with us now. I keep forgetting about it every single time unless I go through the other way. I still miss our cotton candy head. Hey, that's- You know it's weird. I oh, okay, when never mind. Estelle ate that Nia fruit. Well, that was quite a face she made. Oh, come to think of it, it's been a long time since we've been on our own, huh, pal? I haven't been feeling like myself, even when I'm fighting. It's like I'm tired all of a sudden. You mind keeping an eye out for a while, repeat? <laughs> Woof. Anybody remember the impossible quiz? That one question with the dog that goes woof, woof, woof. Oh, that's what I think about here. All right, this is the moment. This is the moment that I think some Yuri, you... uh, folks about Yuri might forget about. Huh? Idiot! Huh? Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, Carol! The... Whoa! What? Carol? That's murderous intent! Holy smokes! Brain dead piece of crap! Hey, hold on a sec. You trying to be some stupid lone wolf or something? Yo, well, I mean, I don't have that art yet. Wolf. Wait, I... This is where he gets the Maybe idea. Excuses for later. You're not a part of our guild. Huh? For now, you can drop dead. <laughs> Jeez, <laughs> everybody going off. Cutscene fireball, Cut even off screen, it hurts. Hey there, sunshine. Still living? Maybe. <laughs> well, it looks like you're Maybe. Now. How nice. No, 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 no. I don't need another haymaker from Judy. Jeez, repeat. What happened to keeping a lookout? <laughs> Off with their heads. I get right it now. To you, like a good boy. He's pretty clever, you know. Yeah. He they all should have punched him here, way, to be honest. Like how they did Raven. The Do you guys know what's going on? Do you really understand what has to happen after this? You're the one who doesn't understand. That's right, Carol. Carol. Go off. You can't. This is one thing you can't just do on your own, Yuri. What were you trying to prove? How far did you think you'd get without us? Yuri, even if you leave us behind thinking you don't need us, we're still going to search the whole world from top to bottom. Um, until well, we find it's you. the light of the, it's the shades of the tree, that's why. What it's it shining on them. down to is it's no fair keeping all the fun and glory to yourself. Would it hurt for you to believe in us a little bit more? See, they all call call Yuri out on going off on his Yuri? own here at this point. Yeah, I mean we're he, your friends. He's gonna change himself up after this. You got me, guys. All right then, we're all in this together until the end. I. Right. Um. Duh. So let's go do this thing. The way out of the forest. Is Maybe they could have spent there. a little bit more time on it to balance out the amount of times Yuri often goes off on his own. Especially in Act One. I'm never gonna for forget I'm never gonna forget that Bamco. But um Yeah, they, they do call him out on it here. And it's to build up further from like basically what Brave Vesperia sort of like established um back in Ospio. Like it's it happens. Maybe you wanted more? Hey, I understand, but I'll I'll take it. I'll take what I can get. Especially because this game is long. <laughs> no, that's not that's not the whole thing to it. But hey, it is what it is. I I I, I don't mind it. Man, we we're really all the way back here in Act One, are we? We never we were never back here since. Oh, is that an egg bear? Uh, we we haven't been here since um since day one. Oh, the memories flooding back to me. You remember the very beginning? When Yuri and Carol kept using all my life bottles when I had limited resources? 
Oh boy, those were times. Well, if it isn't the those were times. Nets, I guess they're getting ready to invade the capital. This is a Grand yeah, George scene like where he explores stands, Yuri's yeah. range a bit, and I'll remember wrong. this one. I remember this one most from last year because oh, yeah. this Yuri, is where he did explore Yuri here, and I like the scene as a result. Did you forget that he's leading the knights? I really doubt there's any way he could come with us. As soon as the scouts return, gather all of the lieutenants. Yuri, everyone. Like that was my first impression. I guess we'll see it again to see how I feel about it. Seeing it, I guess, a third Thank time. Thank goodness you're all right. Her Highness must still be in Zophius, then. Yeah, for now at least. What are you doing out here? The Royal Guard has taken up their positions ahead. We're just waiting on the scouts I sent to observe the enemy forces. Captain, you don't have the time to be speaking with... No need to worry. We don't plan on staying long. You're going to the capital, too? Yeah, watch out for that yes. Sodia. There's something She's like there, to prepared to give you, you like a can of coke or something. Captain. Or seven up. It's fine. I'll be back soon. If there are any movements, be sure to notify me. Let's go. Prince Yoder informed me of what's been going on. About Lady Esther. Grand George gets to too. do his thing. Same if with the uh, really Samrigal. You might have to. Hey, the whole reason we're going to the capital is to prevent that from happening. I know that. I'm only talking about the worst case scenario. I've already made my choice. Or have you forgotten? No. I'm, I'm prepared for the worst, but I'm going in the hope that it can be avoided. What are you going to do? I've been thinking about this for a long time now. What is a law? What is a crime? Where is the line between right and wrong? After much consideration, I came to the undeniable conclusion that such a clear distinction cannot be made. Even now, my belief that we all need laws hasn't changed. But even so, I cannot bring myself to call you evil. That's why I hoped that we could make a world where we wouldn't have to keep repeating the same mistakes. Yet look at what's happening now. Then why not come with us? The capital's full of air, so your knights wouldn't be able to enter. But if you come with us, even if we can't get everyone through, we might be able to manage some of them. Dang nomos, huh? Honestly, I don't know what's gonna happen from here on out, so you're gonna have to decide for yourself what to do. I... Excuse me, sir. Oh, oh, I remember what happens here next, too. Yeah, this is good as well. What? Oh my gosh, the murders, they're everywhere. Who let who let oh, the murders Harry, out? We're in big trouble. How could they have been hiding so many of their forces? It looks like we're going to have some difficulty breaking through that. Some? No, that's gonna be brutal. By the time we get to the capital, we'll already be half dead. It's not like we have to face those things head on. Patty, do you see any way around them? Hmm. There's nothing but enemies anywhere I look. I have a feeling it might be impossible. But we're so close to the capital. So this scene was added in DE. I mean, I, obviously. But it, they're coming this way. Hey, shouldn't we withdraw back to the hold? I guess it never really occurred to me when I first played. I didn't think like the first part was added, Captain. and it wasn't voiced or something. Yuri. Yeah, these scenes make a lot of sense for Flynn. Are you going to the capital to when stop bring that up the clips. And to save her highness? Yeah. Then, no matter how this ends, I believe that what you've decided is the best possible outcome. Flynn. You should go. Knights! <laughs> oh, I'm reminded of the movie. An enemy battalion stands before us. And Alexei He's the only to learn from him. Them. I won't tell you this will be easy, and I understand if you want to flee. But I want you to remember what it is that we must do, what it is that we're protecting. 
We're knights. <laughs> this is good. With our swords, we protect the people. I will not force any of you to fight. But if you share the same spirit as I do, then let us fight this battle together. Yeah. Yeah. It really is amazing. Imperial Knights. Straight ahead. <laughs> Yo, we get to see Flynn do his job, like his actual job as a captain. Like, yeah, we Let's see bits and pieces, but this was like, yeah, that's more, more like it. <laughs> All right, there's a dangerous dust, but yeah, that was a good scene. I like it because, like, you know, it it gives Flynn more perspective. Like, the little bits we got during Bakchin. Eh, it, it, it made up for what is set up during that cutscene specifically. It's hard to believe we're really back in and uh, Heracles. Now that I think about it, this is so horrible. The plants are all overgrown. It's got to be the air. Of course it is. <laughs> it's like Symphonia. What's the issue? Mana. What's the issue here? Air. We'd definitely be in trouble without that sword. I forgot what a business was. Phonons. Yeah, Phonons. <laughs> I forgot how did I forget about phonons. Hey, I've been on pins and needles since we got here. Oh, Alright, this next dungeon, you could also get a little bit lost in an eensy bit. Depending on order and everything. But it's not as terrible as Heracles, I wanna say. Give it a rest. I'm not going off by myself anymore. Look! Monsters got in here! I guess when I was talking about the Grand George stuff, How? I the I guess he didn't explore as much as I thought fine. he did. I don't know why I thought he explored more there earlier. Like hmm, crazy, memory's failing me like a bit. I guess he I guess the exploration was a bit better at like Ospio huh? when he was telling oh, that guy nothing. off on Patty. Let's go. We can't keep Estelle waiting. Hmm? The lower quarters at the bottom of that slope. It's his home. And I guess Rita didn't know that. Not this like Not the rest of these guys. The that makes sense. No wonder Raven filled him in. <laughs> Exploit Sam Regal popping up. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> pretty much. That was more Sam Regal's time to shine. And that, yeah, that was yeah, that was a good scene for Flynn. <laughs> I didn't realize how much of a good scene for Flynn that was until now. Actually, I think I did realize it was an okay scene for Flynn. What I thought I knew was that it was something shared between Flynn and Yuri, but it was just a Flynn thing. Damn, it shut up tight. Look up there! I might be able to squeeze through. Oh, I missed the thunder. Nice. Granted, I can Eagles hear the lightning. And open it from the other side. Let's reverse that. I missed the lightning, but I could hear the thunder. We're counting on you! Oh yeah, I guess technically Carol does do like a pick lock sort of thing here, huh? So his skill does show up after Act One. All right. We just don't particularly see it. It's got to be in the castle too. Alexei must have taken some sort of precautions against that. I mean, sure, Patty could be picked up, uh, could be tossed up there, but can she pick lock? That's the key. Got it. Everybody, hurry! Good work. Literally. Okay, this is it, folks. I don't think there's any enemies on the. Well, a anywho, Carol was able to pull it off. That's the important part. Huh? There's no air. I'm not here. ready for this. I'm not ready he for must this. Have figured out how to use Estelle's power to do this. I have painful memories it of this may place. Have been that the outer barrier was to keep the air in. Not just because I was I force fed myself in uh, uh, toilet gel. More likely by the minute, old man. We're gonna have company before long. Why is it I'm only ever right about the bad stuff happening? If you only think negatively, only bad stuff's going to happen. So just think positively. What was it? There was a toilet gel we picked well up here, yet I'm sure you're right we, about that. we suddenly have class the moment we went to Dongress. Well, granted, mm. we did have money Always there compared myself to as here. an optimist, to be honest. <laughs> just like the problem is like, oh, there's so a toilet gel. I don't want to pick that up. Anything. But the toy gel and Zafias? Yeah, let's pick that one up. Forward. Yeah, those bogus knights who've sided up with the bad guys don't stand a chance. 
Yeah. It's too bad in a way. I finally get to see the castle, but not for the reason I was hoping. <laughs> oh, Carol, you're such a kid. You're just like, it's all good. Let's go. <laughs> Did he make the pouty face for a second there? I missed it. Now I can't unsee Tiny Lloyd again, now that I, that I brought it up. I gotta call Carol Tiny Lloyd every time now. Darn it. I've unseen it for so many years, but now I can't unsee it again. Yeah, so in this in this castle in the in 360, they played uh, Duke's theme. Hold on, someone's Yeah, there. they change it to this theme in this game. I don't know if like if they if this theme does eventually show up in 360. I think somebody said it did, but I uh I thought it was just um DE exclusive personally. <laughs> what the? Yuri? Oh, it's Yuri! Ah, oh, this huh? is sweet, though. Hanks? Hanks I say. Everyone. You're all okay. <laughs> hey, that's my line. Why I still can't believe those two knights in the back are the ones that yeah, caused me the most too. trouble still. The ones that ran into that wall. I see y'all. Well, Sir Flynn ordered me to lead the evacuation of the citizens. However, I realized that the inhabitants of the lower quarter were nowhere to be found. It wasn't part of my orders, but... This was cool. Like, this was a very shiny moment for the Schwann Brigade. They certainly, um, got some glowing points in my eyes of this scene, that's for sure. It's been a long time since we've seen the lower quarter. It's like the, the start of this dream. Like, the very beginning. I am prepared to receive punishment for violating my orders. I say, we will, we take, will the take the same, same punishment. punishment. <laughs> Yo, Bogos there was waiting, punishment? was waiting for that timing. Man, you boys. knew he wanted, he really tried that anyway, moment. isn't it the duty of the knights to protect the citizens? You did well. Th this is an honor. Captain Schwa- uh, Captain Raven. Don't call me Captain. I'm just Raven. Sir, I Oh, I thought it was LeBlanc you guys Raven. were talking about. Okay, well then they, they did it fine with Adakor. With the with the eye like say that's, that's an okay localization. I never would have believed it. Guess you can't judge a book by its cover. This is great, Yuri. Huh, I forgot how tough everyone was. What was I worried about? Man, Yuri is happy. Is Yuri, very happy. You look yeah, happier thanks, than Patty. I've ever seen you before. Yeah, <laughs> Patty right. is just like a commentator now <laughs> for this game base. Yeah, that's practically what Did Patty is. She's just commandant? as much of a commentator as I am. <laughs> useless sir, until no, suddenly uh, useful. But we overheard the royal guard outside. Something Anywho. Like the sword stair? The sword stair? That really sword tall stare. thing we got blasted off of. So that means he's still up there. Sounds like smoke and scoundrels both like high places. The problem is only important that, people that's can not get even to related the to the stair. that's not even related to the sea, Patty. Mechanism. You're just running out of material. <laughs> I can take your locks. Rita can take your formulas. We can do it. You said it. Hanks, all of you should stay here and hide. Let's go. <laughs> Carol with the fist pump times two. Okay. Uh by the way. It's still here. Still good, by the way. Okay, uh, let's give uh, Judy some time to shine. Uh, who else did I use for this fight? Did I really not take a note of this? I could have sworn I did. Well, anyhow, uh, Rita already had her time to shine, so I think I kept it with the uh, Raven, maybe Patty, and oh no, actually no, Rita should be in this fight. Rita should be in this fight. I mean, this should be fine, I'd say. Okay, I'm gonna do some skill management here, so please bear with me. I just wanna make sure that I have everybody's skills before I start selling them off. Uh, yeah, I checked Hades already. War Harpoon already checked. Uh, Hades, War Harpoon, Dark Sight. Did I say Dark Sight? No, no, Death Sight. Okay, there we go. Okay, 
Judy's fine. How's Raven? Raven is okay. Looks like Raven is okay. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Raven's fine. Okay, next up. Uh, Pat, I think Patty's okay. I don't think I need to check on her. Yeah. Uh, Rita. Oh, oh, she has a lot to go over again. Um, I think I got this. I think I got this. Got this. Got this. Uh, let me double check that. Yeah, definitely got that. Uh, and I got real swift too. Cool. Uh, Yuri's I already checked, but I want to double check to make sure. No, I think we're fine. Uh, repeat. Repeat's okay. Carol. Ooh. Yeah, I gotta double check some of these. Um, I think I did the Braveyard stuff already, right? Oh, no, I didn't. Okay, okay. Let's uh, get that. I know he can't sell the Braveyard, but I still want to make sure that I have his stuff for Braveyard. Uh, motion change. There we go. And I guess nobody didn't really want to answer the motion change thing, so I'll leave it in my placebo mind. <laughs> okay, Riot. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, we got that. I should bring it up to the front here to speed it up a little bit. Uh, Crimson Axe? Oh, we don't have that. Oh, I'm so glad we're checking this now because I don't want to, like, sell these, uh, equipment thinking I don't have their, uh, their, uh, their skills. Okay. Uh, Gaia Cleaver? I think we did that already. Because we have, a uh, Roaring Revolution. Oh, not Roaring. Destruction Street. Uh, Deadly Horn, I think we got. Yeah, we did. Uh, Guardian Stamp. Yes, we do. Okay, cool. Uh, Carol is good. And I think that's everybody. Okay. Oh, that reminds me. I gotta do some of the equipment. Uh, the, the armor, too. Keep Dane Nomos on. Okay. Now we should be good to shop. Uh, I'm gonna save just in case <laughs> if I if I accidentally screw something up with selling something not uh, Not something that should not have been sold. Okay Now it's time for our um, uh, Restocking on supplies here. I want to stay here while I shop here because like um, The song is playing in the background too. You lose the song after you leave the um, You leave this room. So it, it's, it's a nice like soothing reminder of, uh, it's a nice, uh, calm place before things are about to go to crap again. Okay, I think we should be good there. Um, weapons. Yeah, that's gonna be good. That's gonna be okay. Uh, Raven's got that. Yep. Wait, was that? Oh, it's area stuff. I thought it was <laughs> jump cancel. I think jump cancel comes much later, though. Okay, so let's, uh, equip that on... First, let's get Yuri's skills to complement that. Um, they're all on the blue side, it looks like. One, two, three. Okay. And now... Let's give it to Carol. Because I think Carol will be the one who's running with that. Was jump, jump cancel in Kapua Noor? Okay. Well... <laughs> well, we'll be back there another time, that's for sure. That's for sure. Okay. Uh, did I get it for those two? Was there another item that was missing? Anubis! Ah, yes. Bring him back to the Shadow Realm. No, nah, that's too much of a reach. Anyway. Uh, Spirit Conversion is kind of amusing. No, I'm thinking of a different skill. But it's still pretty good in itself. Um, Burst Guard? Yeah, we'll definitely need that. Granted, I don't think, uh, I have Rita's AI to use Burst Guard, any or Burst Arts anyway, so. Um... I guess it'll help out for the for the icons. Uh, I think that's everything there. Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay, time to do some selling. Uh, we don't need this, 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 uh, this. Actually, we should keep that. We'll keep that for for fling, cause why not? Uh, okay, get rid of those. Next up, we got. Flynn is the only one who comes in with new accessories every single time, and it, and it frustrates me a little bit. Just an easy bit. Uh, yeah, we'll keep that for Yuri, why not? I never use access for Yuri. Um, for people who do, more power to you, but that's not a thing for me. Okay, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, that. 
<laughs> We're shopping, shopping. Menuing, menuing, menuing. I want to keep that because I never grinded it. <laughs> uh, I, I can't believe I keep missing it in all of my practices. Holy smokes. Okay. Uh, anything else we could possibly make? I already have one of those. I don't see anything here. Nothing here. Voila. Nothing. Can we make any of these? No. <laughs> We're not lucky enough. Okay. Now let's uh, get some more equipment. Uh, it's good for Judith. Good for... for <laughs> I was going to say Cappy, but... <laughs> That's Patty. Uh, all right, got some of these, three of these, three of these, none of these. Actually, this might be useful a bit, but I hate physical attacks personally. They're much more common than spells hitting the back lines as much because we're constantly trying to throw them anyway. Uh, okay, got that. Okay, so now I gotta fix up uh, Patty's and Judith's. Oh, Patty gets her Mystic Art from a weapon too. Yeah, that was a very essential purchase then. Okay, Brainiac Speedcast is really good. I can't wait for her to unleash her randomness. Okay, uh, that's fine. And then, let's see what Judy's got here. We got a. What was it again? Hold up. Let me just take this off a bit, because I think- Oh no, you can't take those off, okay. Aerial Step and Cobble Force, okay. No, that ain't it. Uh, and I think that's it for weapons, right? Yeah, it looks like it. Um... Okay, gotta sell some of the stuff that we just took off. Uh, there was one for Judy, which was Death Sight, and one for um, Patty right over here. We don't need the get anymore. Um, armor. Yeah, it's time for us to get rid of some of the stuff here. At least, like, in a casual playthrough, it's, it's much more calming to get rid of... Um, armor compared to weapons because weapons they have so much essential things that you need to keep <laughs> but armor not quite as much for a casual perspective of course okay so now that we got that done i think all that stuff is the main armor right here need two of those i think yeah, she, she comes back with that, I'm pretty sure, so I'm going to buy that. Okay, uh, one more time. And, uh, I think we got everything, I hope. I don't need gold leggings. Uh... Yeah, you know, that's a good point, Eclipse. It really does ruin the suspense. But unfortunately, it's a game at the end of the day. If they're, <laughs> it would it would take effort basically. It would have been nice if they didn't though. Uh, okay, I think we're supplied up here. Okay, <laughs> we got everything. We got everything. Make another save just in case. All right, time for this dungeon's puzzle here. Uh, it's an amusing puzzle. I actually like it on on casual playthrough. I uh, it 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 is interesting to learn once you figure out the gimmick. Wait, I already went the wrong way, did I? Oh, uh, <laughs> I mean, no, I took the long way. There's a shorter way to get to where I need to go, but I took the the long way. Puzzles that are not blocks are definitely a good thing. Uh, I think I need to go here, right? <laughs> I hope I'm going the right way. No, no. Yeah, I, I took the long way. There's an easier way to get to where you need to go from the curry room, I like to call it, but I, I'm taking, I'm making my three 
my three lefts. I don't think that was it. Uh, it's the one right over here. <laughs> it's definitely the long way. Oh well. Oh well. We took the scenic route. We took the scenic route. Not like I should have taken the scenic route. That really wasn't a good idea, but... Uh, let's just head up over here first to activate a small cutscene, but kind of random. A little bit. A little bit, not really. I don't know. I guess it depends. For me, when I didn't care about Vesperia eight years ago... I thought this was random. A Critian? No, wait, you were. Meet Chroma, special <laughs> advisor to the Imperial Knights, Alexei's personal assistant. Alexei. Hey, Chroma. But that would mean. Then she's an enemy. No, I am not. For the time being, in any case. That's not a very comforting way to put it. Sorry, but we got somewhere to go. If you're here to fight, fine. If not, maybe it could wait until later. Um, I don't think we should fight be for? fighting right now, Yuri. We what we have a mean? mission. That poor, pathetic young girl. Hey. She doesn't need your pity. You watch your tongue. You are being really vague. Come on, spit it out already. No, I that's for birth. I what that one saw in all of you. But I wish for you to stop him. <laughs> like, all right, thanks. Makes no sense. Did anybody get what she was trying to say? Chroma needs to be fleshed out a little bit more. Maybe I thought she she's okay. She Alexei? serves her purpose. Maybe. And we don't know about that until the Maybe next act, up, anyway. Yes, Estelle should be just up ahead. I, but stopping is so half-hearted. We're going to destroy him. <laughs> it's like, it hey, like thanks for the dialogue, Chroma. See ya. The wall. We forgot you existed. I could handle that. Come on. All right, I gotta make sure I know where I'm going here. Okay, uh, so we gotta leave here. Uh, first switch is all the way to the east. So the whole shtick to this puzzle is like, oh, um, there's something in that room where we spoke with uh, Chroma was that like we needed to know something about the sun and the child of the full moon or something and basically the shtick is is that you gotta sorcerer ring these uh statues in the right order um and you'll get your hint by looking at the flooring right over here so it starts off with uh no moon being filled and then uh you're gonna see your quarter moon your half moon and your full moon so you gotta like light them up in that order by using the floor markings to help you out if you do anything in the wrong order, then you'll do an encounter. So make sure you know you pay attention to that, basically. Crucible, Ethanor, perfect. Boy, bottle up. Patty is getting to pet up. <laughs> oh, from the last cutscene, yeah. Okay, uh, second switch. We gotta go all the way outside. You remember the the statue of the goddess underneath the goddess? Well, now we gotta go to the left of the goddess to find our second statue, which uh, obviously you can see the ones that you have access to in Act One. So they currently don't serve any purpose, but I guess you could call it an, uh, a hint for later. I don't know, but to help you be more aware, basically. Uh, when you get to the next act and get more info, I'm just confused about why she... Well, she does explain it, right? I'm, I'm positive she does. Like, <laughs> well, we'll get there when we get there, basically. Oh, I'm supposed to go west now. Yeah, I'm not supposed to go here just yet. Okay, so right over here, we're going to go a little bit further up north. And this will be our third one. With some more lovely treasures. Vagabond plus one. We did not need to craft that for um, repeat, but he has a little fun ability here where it shows the enemy's HP above him. People who are hardcore into Vesperia might not care, but I do. <laughs> I certainly do, but I don't think I'm going to have repeat as much of my party any anymore after this.
All right, and the fourth switch is all the way back to where you're supposed to learn the tutorial about the the enemy icons. You know, the one for people who play JRPGs other than Tails. That room. So, how many people got lost in this area? I certainly did get lost trying to keep track of things, and I was a little bit ashamed. I'm like, oh, I've been here before. Why am I not remembering where everything is? It's like, to be honest, it's been a long time since we've gone through this dungeon. I mean, it's the very first act of the game, so I kind of forgave myself afterwards. But, yeah, I, I, re I remember being very lost when I returned here and when I did my casual playthrough last year and when uh, I did my first playthrough as well. It's always easy to get lost in this area. For me, at least. I think everybody's still fine, though. Nothing's changed. Why am I taking the long route again? <laughs> there is clearly a path right here. You got lost as well? Yeah. 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 I'm glad I'm amongst uh, peers. Alright. I hope my holy bottle didn't run out. Don't you dare run out on me. <laughs> I know I have a habit of jinxing myself. Don't you dare run. Okay, good. Thank you. <laughs> if I had taken the long route, then maybe I would have ran out. I'm shooting. I should not have bought an Elder Cloak. Did I Did I make that as a note? I did make that as a note. Ah! <laughs> Humans are a blue shell. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, is there a nice... Wait, 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 what? The throne has a nice item for Rita? What do you mean? <gasps> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> let's get this going. I had no idea it was there. I was wondering why do I have it in in <laughs> in like my 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 casual file, but I couldn't find it anywhere else. I, I just gave up and thought I like uh, crafted it or something. Wow, that's oh, that's really useful. Thank you. Uh, okay, I'm gonna make sure that we're all good here, though. I think I'm okay. Think I'm okay. I think I'm ready. One thing I do want to do is give Yuri the Emerald Ring, and then now I think it should be okay. <sighs> No, no, we gotta save that for the very end. I, I, I ain't using that song quite yet. Though I imagine the, the countdown for a rise might be humming that right now. Like, uh, all you guys doing that uh, art project. Uh, welcome back, ZX. Oh, 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 I'm not looking forward to this at all, at all. Poor Estelle, though. Poor Estelle. Astounding. I thought that crash would have been the last of you. If we hadn't been lucky, you just might have gotten your wish. You can let her go now and save yourself some pain, or we can break you first. What's up with it's the voice filter call. in this scene? Sorry. To I know there was some weird voice filter see, issues when this game went over from 360 to Definitive Edition. To Again, it must be another case of the Magic Studio <laughs> that recorded these these three games. The princess was splendid. Her power equals the ancient children of the full moon. Every person has a role, and the princess has played her part exceedingly well. I mean, yeah, it, yeah, it was a cup of tea. I'm more so thinking, like, right what's now? the recording studio that they weren't able to, like, um, to replicate? I don't think it's a mixing thing. As you I honestly don't think it's a mixing thing, personally. Because it, if, if it was a mixing thing, they, they would have fixed it in this Let's game. Go. But... It, it happened in Symphonia, and it happened in this game. So I want to say there's some kind of magic studio that both those games had that for some reason they can't replicate the, the audio with Still. 
with their file, or maybe it's a file formatting thing. I don't know. Like, I'm just speculating all over the place here, but... It's either that or a file, a file or something. What would you do with the princess now? Her power Is it though? Because Patty, Patty's lines in battle, she, she they're really loud. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm guessing it's more like a compression thing. Cause like Flynn, Flynn is quiet, and I'm guessing they probably re reused his, uh, his attack grunts from 360, so they couldn't like recompensate the mixing for that. The princess was a tool most crucial to my plans. As were you, Schwan. And Did me, uh, survive, it's been a long time since I, I played Exilia once, so I don't remember. Return like the puppet you are. Sorry, but you buried that poor schmuck alive yourself. I'm Raven. Pleased to meet you. So why did Alexa give her weapons? Play, to do this, obviously. <laughs> Even though so many live such meaningless mundane lives, Mila was quiet not. silent. If they choose that life, then so what? That's what deciding for yourself means. You have no right to decide whether they're meaningless or not. How unfortunate. We will never see eye to eye. <laughs> well, we try to reason with you, but that's a different game entirely. No! Still, don't do this! Damn it! Alright, here we go. Oh, that! That's what you're all talking about. Okay. 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 You know what? Because <laughs> that's gonna open up a different can of words for me altogether, but I'm gonna save that maybe until I start to get used to this fight right now. This fight isn't so bad at the moment. Ah, yes! This was the art that, like, sold me on Patty when I played Raze. When she did. When she did Dreamstar, I was like, what is this? I don't think I had a, a Patty in this fight when I practiced at all. I don't remember my team composition for this at all. Did I learn anything new for... Um, Oh, moon, Moonbeam would be useful. <laughs> That's for sure. Uh, I don't know if I can use it well with my current setup, but I'll try. Oh, Piercing Moon is what I want. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, perfect timing. We're in a good pace right now. <laughs> this is where I learned Piercing Moon. I remember that much. Wait, what is she weak to? She's not weak to anything. Okay. There it is, tidal wave. Yeah, there's something about file compression about um, Mila's. Um... What the? What the? What? What? Oh, ills from a ills from a ills from a, her random spells that she did. Angel. I'm confused. What? Patty, you're confusing me with your randomness. Oops. Oops. Oh, I forgot to set myself to full charge, but now we gotta go to the defense. Oh, and she does a spinning thing too when she goes into over limit. That's cool. That's cool. Consistency. Consistency. Oh, critical mode, yeah, Patty. Oh, there's the trolling. There's the trolling. Wait, I don't have magic guard on Judy? What? I didn't get her magic guard? You no, 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 no. I I must have got her magic guard somewhere. No, 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 no. No. I think it. So why didn't I equip? I forgot to equip her magic guard. I forgot to equip her magic guard. She comes into the party with magic guard, and I forgot to equip it. Fantastic, fantastic. Yeah, AI knows what's up. Yeah, Patty, you're the best. Yeah. Oh, uh, 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 Luna, Luna, rise. Didn't have to react to that yet.
I wish I had more of her skills to sort of take advantage of Dom Moon. Oops. Ah, oh, man, what the heck? Yeah, Patty! Way to go! Oh, you've got to be in full charge. Oh, you face. See these, these. Oops! Sorry, Rita. That was my fault. Hey, if I if I blame AI for knocking people out of spells, I can blame myself too. It has to be fair game here, after all. Okay, I thought that was an Estelle nurse for some reason, even though she clearly wasn't casting. Oops. Ah, I keep screwing that up. Anywho. Violent pain. We didn't need that, Patty, but thanks anyway. I appreciate the extra assurance. Darn it. Oh, actually, that worked. I forgot how, how much range, the, like, Moonbeam has. I keep screwing that up, too. Jump back, then you stop. Oy vey. Well, Patty's almost done. And a Patty, uh, Estelle. 1 H- 1 HP? 1 HP? That's rare in this game, but alright. Bye. Huh? What- what- what just happened? Was it was that a was that a skill? Was that a Hmm. Perhaps that was not enough power. What huh, alright. Whatever. Thanks to you. Was it Raven? Okay. To replace Dane but no, I I hit Estelle and nothing happened. Oh, it's cause like oh it was it, it, it was the huh, it was a fatal strike? Okay. Alright, so you know that fight that I'm worried about? This is the fight that I'm worried about. This fight. Because in my most recent practice, I thought she was a pushover. But she trolled me. You want to know how she trolled me? I was just styling, playing around with Yuri, like messing up with his arts, doing some mix-ups, and then all of a sudden, when she was down to like 10,000... No, she was down to like 10,000 HP, yeah. I tried to do the Mystic Guard finish, and I was like a like 100 HP off, and then she went into Overlimit, she casted Nurse twice, and she bursted Art me to death. It was painful, and then she killed me two more times. <laughs> so, if you're hoping for some game overs, this might be the time. This might be the moment. <sighs> I really hope it doesn't happen, though. I really hope it doesn't. If it happens, well, all of you all who, who've been waiting since got to so, you will get your you will get your wish. But I'm not looking forward to what comes up next, not at all. Game over, yeah. Still one of the best game over shouts. <sighs> uh, what is that? We saw that. At Miorzo. It's that ring we saw in the mural. I like seeing that ring, even though the narrative, the characters don't. I just like it because that means we're getting close to the end of Act 2, everybody. It's like a release of stress from my mind. Especially considering how far behind we were yesterday. This is... This is gonna be good. Yeah, don't all the human bosses have, like, tech out options or something? Which once obliterated the catastrophe that threatened our world. That's a blastia? Maybe you could save this little speech until you get some. Ah. Uh, embarrassing yourself. The show. I'm not ready for what's to happen. I'm not ready for what's cutting. next. Now, princess, do your friends. Don't do it. Don't do it. Maybe you could bring her with you. Jeez, by the way, Alexei with that line. Maybe you could start by severing your friends' heads from their bodies. Jeez, Wesker, chill. Come on, man. Oh, how the poor girl will 
she'll feel when she comes to her senses. <laughs> it's Carol's job. <laughs> Did he just Tempest out of here? I mean, I Tempest out, like, using, like, the art, but not this. Well, it's like, we gotta reuse this one one more time. Hey, hey, hey. Sad Don't moment for us, free. though. Sad moment. Yuri! Yuri! Okay. Estelle, whatever you do, we're friends, right? Don't troll me. Don't troll me, Estelis. I'm using your full name. Even the game's using your full name. Don't troll. Okay. Uh, I haven't played as Yuri as well, so I'm gonna double check his stars real quick. Uh, did I get Wheeling Havoc in? Doesn't look like I did, huh? Uh, do I even have Raging Blast in? Yeah, I do. Okay. Think we should be okay. What the hell do you think you're doing? I. I. No! No more, please! Do you really plan to die here? You think Oops. it's okay to die? Oh, I'll definitely want that. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where'd it go? Oh, it's an arcane. Dumb, stupid. Uh, there you go. Look me in the eye, Estelle. <laughs> Did she taunt at me? Okay. Oh, jeez, I've got to cancel that. Oops. Why? She certainly knows how to use a sword, that's for sure. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez. Ah! No! No! No, 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 no. Oops. Did it wrong, did it wrong. Ah! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Estelle, chill, 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 please. I said chill! Didn't want to use one. Alright, now we're doing really bad. Okay. I'm getting a little bit shook a bit. Maybe because like I'm nearing the end of this part and I'm a little bit I'm staring at my I'm staring at my salmon. Don't you dare. Okay, how much HP? Okay, still a ways to go. Still a ways to go. Oops, why do I keep screwing that up every single time? Oops, no, that wasn't the yard I was supposed to use. Where did I put it? Where did I put it? Uh. Uh, oh, I just had a standard down. Oops. That's... <laughs> run! Run! No! No, you! 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 Oh! 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 oh. <laughs> oh! <laughs> you can't use the menu when she uses the burst art, by the way. You can't use the menu when she uses the burst art. Just saying that right now. Ah! Oh, I keep screwing. Okay, this is throwing me off. I need to put this in a uh, severing fang. 
Uh, where are we at? Where are we at? Okay, and this is Lone Wolf Charge. Okay. Okay, you can bow again. Ah! <laughs> I'm so mad. I'm so mad at this boss. Oops, oops, oops. Way too early. Way too early. I'm so mad again. Okay. Do your thing. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Now I'm doing the other thing. Jeez, whatever. Whatever. Do your thing. Okay. Deep. Oh, that's why, because it becomes an altered art. No wonder. Duh, I forgot to fix that. Oops. Anywho. Not this time, not this time, not this time. Uh, uh, <laughs> she wants me dead. She wants me dead. Ah, uh, that, uh, I saw it, I saw it, I saw it. Oops, that didn't reach. Okay, I think it's time. There we go. Okay, we did it. <laughs> there we go. I was really worried for this fight, but we got it. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, super troll, super troll. <laughs> okay. 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 I'm okay with that. Even though I did use quite a bit of items, I, 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 I was really mad. Estelle made me so mad. Made me so mad, but we're okay. We did it. <laughs> Yeah, I got super lucky with that. Oh my gosh, I was like a Judith level like luck during that Bite of Joe fight from earlier. Like someone else's tool. You say that EDMG, but we don't, we don't really see too much of this mind control stuff like uh, in Tales. I don't think we do. So this is like this is a uh, different. In the series, at least, I want to say. Okay, you can say Bamco, but I'm saying Tails. <laughs> I don't care if you, you say other Namco games, sure. I'm, well, actually, maybe don't, because it might be spoilerish. Symph nah, Symphonia don't count. Symphonia, that's different. The, the enemy wasn't actively using her, really. You did it, Estelle! You're you again! Wait! The system! It was I was re really worried for this fight, but we did it. Without <laughs> that... But I, I see why you would think that's a great area. I understand where you're coming from, but yeah, uh, it's definitely different from what we got here with um, with uh, Estelle. I can't, I can't stop it now. Everyone, run! Don't worry, we're not gonna lose you. I might be able to use his system. All right, Rita. Amazing. Be like every other technician, like in the eighties or the nineties, when they see a computer. Keep keep pushing keys. And she, oh no, you hear you hear this stuff like the 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 techno babble in the beginning here. She's gonna get more into it in uh in Act Three when she gets really into the air. I don't mean literally. Let me try it. Let me help. I'll keep track of the flow of air. Me too. I'll help out. Oh, damn this useless body. Oh, poor Please. Raven. We know we know you'll help in spirit. 
What did I say? We're not gonna lose you. When Brave Asteria does something, we do it right. Okay. That's the spirit. Oh yeah, speaking of which, I do like Rita's animations whenever she casts a spell. I'm pretty sure that's very commonly um, shared, a shared opinion, but it, it's like, especially when you hear like the, the sounds of the whip going all over the place. If, if that's a common trope between JRPGs, then oh, okay. I don't really explore too much of too many other JRPGs outside of Tales. Like, I think the only other one I could say is also an obscure one, Department Heaven. Oh, this is a sweet moment for those who like Yuri and Estelle. Just thought I pointed out, that's all. Everybody went wild over Welcome this, back. that's for sure. Nice to be back. Oh, I, I didn't realize around the world plays here. It's so short. Yo, 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 hold up. 1797E, you, you talking about Department Heaven? You're my new favorite chat member. No, okay, so Department Heaven, my favorite is Zygdra Union. Second would be uh, uh, Nice of the Nightmare. Riviera would be third. I haven't finished uh, Gungnir said. yet. Have you heard of it? No, that's the first time. I wonder what it is. Someday I'll get around to finishing Gungnir. I don't know, but I know what he's gonna use. And I'll play a, the other Union uh, side games as well. For those who don't know Department Heaven, please play those games. They're not on the PSN anymore, unfortunately, because Atlas lost the rights. But I don't know. I still recommend them somehow, some way. We knights are always one step behind. We never would have been able to free the capital if it weren't for Yuri and the others. Much less stop the Blastia from spreading this danger across the land. Why did it say in third person? It was the Yuri's Knights right that there. protected the capital from Heracles, though. Was that something that was like a 360 no thing? We were able to even it probably was, wasn't it? At all. I still, that still didn't make sense even to me when I heard this line voiced. Hey, Estelle came back on her own. Because this, why, why does he say Yuri and the others? I'm still grateful, though. Thank you. Quit it. You're creeping me out. Alexei owes the world this this one is the done. biggest example us. of like the Grant George um Tomorrow, Troy Baker alternating lines that gets very added. distracting. They should have just like had Grant George like redub this line. With you. I think one thing yeah, redubbed with Grant George shouldn't be an issue. So spare many guilt trips tonight. Okay. Captain, so this is where you were. Uh, you again. I can look past it though, but I understand I'm also too much of a difficult. patient person. <laughs> Seems they can't even agree with each other. And one more thing. The council intends to cede all authority to his All right. Yoder so this <sighs> You know how Vesperia wants you all to talk to everybody? Due to your success in I think this is also a big ex <laughs> the biggest example of really trying hard to find everybody. Well, this cleans up also Flynn gets his promotion. Congrats. I really love Watch Flynn getting his promotions versus like you, Yuri completing you're the, one the who stuff. Really did all this. Uh, details, like, it's details. such a cool, like, narrative um, well, flow between both Yuri and Flynn, like, their progressions and whatnot. See ya. It would be cool for me if I were to play the games in Japanese dub, but I don't know. I, I still like preferring to hear the English dub on my own. Um... Go to curry room. Yeah, curry room first. <laughs> yeah, it's like call it the curry room. I think the curry room is to the right, if I recall correctly. <laughs> Eclipse has a bit of a mood. <laughs> uh, it's, it's only because like you you speed run it. I understand why. <laughs> What's up, Carol? Oh, Yuri! Take a look! It's as good as new! You know what? If I had the time, I would make the tweet That's not you about Vesperia. It's like, 
regarding it's the fine. the Yuri lines, would you prefer Thanks. when they mix between like um uh, stuff. They got Baker and, and George. Would you prefer that they even went back to they the still kept it as it was in definitive edition? Would you rather Grant George redub everything, or would you rather they Actually, had kept um they would not have had Grant George as well and just kept Yuri silent as Troy Baker? These are my favorite shoes. That would be like a question and a curiosity for those who who follow my Twitter awesome. often. He sewed up a dress that was very important to me. Thanks again. Like something along those lines. Are you sure about doing this, Carol? Tomorrow's the Actually, I wouldn't do like the Troy Baker uh, silent thing, basically. It's okay. Like, I would I do would like, would you rather have worried. like what Definitive Edition did with like alternating between Baker and anyway. um, uh, battle, George in the scenes, or would you rather George re redub the scenes where well they alternate lines? Like, those are your only two choices. This is not about like a Yuri. It's not about a, oh, I like Baker or I like George thing. It's more like. What would you have preferred, like, for those mixed, um, help, mixed scenes where they have them alternating their voices? He probably guessed what you were thinking. He doesn't. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, because that's like a, an opinion. I think Vesperians would still be sort of split on here or there. It really depends, basically. <laughs> well, don't push your luck. Ah, oh, come on, repeat. Oh, this boy's got a bright future. I, I'm of the camp that I they should just redub the, the mix scenes. Because it just th throws throws me off as well. Boss of our guild. You might learn a thing or two from him yourself, you know. I walked right into that one. Memories support the heart. And our dearest possessions are the vessels for those memories. Thank you, young man. I'll just do a little more, and then I'll call it a night. I honestly think Bamco was probably scared okay, to tick off the, the people who really want Troy Baker. Yeah, I know. So they, they didn't they didn't want to rock the boat as best as they could because they couldn't get him back in the first place. That's what it feels like to me at least. Uh, okay. Where's everybody else? Uh, Judith is somewhere around here. Hey, Judy. What are you doing, Judy? I'm trying to see if I can contact Pharaoh again. If Zauda is connected to the ancient catastrophe... What? Wasn't Pharaoh it said that, like, about it. Judy also has two different voices? I did not notice at all, so whoever they casted stone? for... I mean, like... I honestly it thought like it was the same actress. Okay. All right, thanks. You know, the only real goal I've had in life has been to destroy the Hermes Blastia. <laughs> maybe, maybe it was a casting choice. Maybe they could have chose Matt Mercer, but I'm pretty sure that. Matt Mercer didn't want to do it because of the whole stigma he had that somebody brought up a day or two ago. Oh, this world, me, lots of things. Had I never met Estelle. I might still be flying around with Baul. I don't know about other games, but yeah, it would have been nice to have had like a too. Grant George there for like sort of a finesse thing. Don't get me wrong. I'm telling him Estelle will be all right because I really believe it. I have no Is it more noticeable on the new arts? I, I've always thought like maybe like it was an age thing with the actress, Is but that okay. part of the lots of things you mentioned? <sighs> Sorry, forget I said that. I won't kill Estelle, nor will I let her be killed. I also can't let Alexei go on. Okay. We head out tomorrow morning. Just get back by then. Understood. Oh, I can almost taste that end game. Judy. It is, it is getting there. Mm -hmm. Let's win. Slowly this. but surely, only because Act Two is okay. really long. Uh. Now I gotta go to the very beginning. Because we gotta speak to additional character. If it weren't for additional character, I wouldn't have to walk all the way. I, she's still fun to play as. I'm just poking fun at her at the end of the day. Don't mind me, it's all just a time thing. What are you doing wandering around? I'm making sure you guys aren't causing any trouble. 
I see. You're wandering around so you can cause some trouble. Uh, no, I said... Eh, never mind. Yeah, C CP, yeah. I, I, I was the same when I first played through this as well. And I think uh, Sir of Us has said so that earlier, earlier as well. We, we all kind of got lost in this castle. And guess what? You have to do it again to find all these carrots to your party members. Yeah, I feel the same. If we hadn't been able to bring her back, would you really have killed her? Why do you ask? Because... I don't know, is what I'd like to say. But if Estelle hadn't heard my voice when she did, I probably would have killed her. How can you go oh, to such lengths knowing it's that's another... That was a line where Grand George got to explore it, but... Estelle's my friend, and I can't let a stranger take care of my friend's problem. Besides, I'm not the one who it hurts the most. A friend's problem? Yuri, you're really strong. Strong, huh? I don't know about that. But what about you? Did you forget your search for the Maristella? Right now, I'm focusing on beating the bad guys. Besides, <laughs> because I've given up on my Maristella. I've got a great no. memory. Ah, oh, the Maristella. Ah. Uh, we'll definitely get to that soon. Yuri, I... I'll never forgive Alexei. Sacrificing someone for his own desires, I could never forgive that. Yeah, I know what you mean. That's why, um... I wouldn't put much in the voice Alexei director. I mean, yeah, done. it's a part of it, but... There are circumstances no, that the voice director can't control. It could be, like, a lot of behind-the-scenes stuff. I'd say, That's like, maybe some kind of, um... rushing to fix our ship. It could be a budget issue. It Gold could be song. that the actor doesn't do Isn't acting anymore. Like, there, there's a, like, a lot can change in 10 years. We'll this game was originally dubbed 10 her. years ago, plus 2008. All right, then we'll use so, it to it, there's no way it could be the same way that it was 10 years ago. Of course! So, uh, Yuri? Patty. Huh? If you're having difficulty saying it... There's no need to force yourself. I'll listen There's when you're ready to talk. There's a good scene to sort of explore so a bit. go get some sleep. Good night. Say that to Jap- Well, that's a- that's a different story. <laughs> if we're talking specifically Vesperia, this- the port came out a year after, um, 360 came out. Like, they don't have to redub anything. And obviously, it's a career path. Like, I think somebody mentioned it in the chat already, so... It's more... It's... <sighs> Voice acting is still very much, like, going through the early growing pains and freshness of, um... Uh, standard of quality, basically. 20 years may sound like a long time, but... For an industry... Not quite as much. It's still evolving a bit, basically. He's actually yeah, sleeping. you said it, so I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> I can't tell if he's brave or just stupid. Weren't you gonna have a touch and reunion with your bestest pal? No, it's that lieutenant of his. Yeah, I hear you. She's scary. We playing it up. Hmm? Oh, well, I guess I can see that. What do you mean? Ah, well, it's just, she's so serious. Gotta be careful not to rub her the wrong way. Hmm. I'm not rubbing anything anyway. Well, you most certainly can't please all the people all the time. <laughs> Sign it, stamp it, post it on a wall. That's a quote. Yeah, I guess you're right. So what are you doing here? Oh, just thinking about stuff. Hey, why are you looking at me like that? With all we've been through, I guess I'm just trying to figure out what I should do with myself. But I keep coming up empty. Change wears me out. You chose your own life. At this point, you should be able to do anything you want. How do I Yeah, there's it? gonna be a couple of cutscenes right over here before once. we move forward, that's for sure. I'm thinking about a bunch of stuff. But I guess thinking about settling things with Alexei is enough for now. The rest will probably come out in the wash. Again, it's one of those moments where we gotta talk to everybody. It sounds okay. But we're to almost me. there. Speaking of settling things, 
I filled Estelle in on all the stuff that happened. Guess what she did? Hmm? She said I had to let her do the same thing everyone else did. <laughs> so she smacked me on the head, called it even. We love that scene, that, to be honest. <laughs> That's Estelle. It kind of hurt, actually. Oh. Well, I think I'm That's gonna a good catch line, my shut-eye in here. Suit yourself. Try not to oversleep for once, though. All right. Uh, what else we got here? Who am I missing? Oh, oh, oh! One, one more set of people, right over here. This will bring the value back down, so the discrepancy with this should. Oh, here she goes. It begins. <sighs> nope, it's nowhere near enough. Like I said, I'm not saying it's like a bad thing. Yay. I mean, how do I how do I explain this? A lot of games here? go through a lot of plot dumps a lot of times. Like guy explains sure, Jade with this alone. hyper. Oh jeez, oh, Vita, <laughs> don't no don't incur the the wrath of the cutscene nice fireball. You too. Um, so what kind of but yeah, like um, anyway? Rain does it, Jade Something does wrong. it, um, uh, Aizen did it no, in Brasaria. It's, well it's just more like the way Rita it. delivers it because she's a scientist. She gets very um, technical and in depth, or it feels like I'm in school. Of are both pretty amazing. It's like uh, <laughs> you you better so pay attention to class basically when Rita prepares some uh, some explanations and whatnot. The control barrier originates at the barrier Blastia. She's stable inside it, but she can't leave. I guess Dane Nomos alone couldn't take the place of all those Apatheia. So long trips are out of the question. Also, the barrier Blastia is part of the system. As long as it's in use, this city is defenseless. That's why I'm out here trying to figure out a way for her to move around freely. Why can't Estelle just take Dane Nomos with her wherever she goes? It's going to be a bit of an issue because really Estelle is synced with the air, uh, air in this area. I don't think it could actually affect Estelle in any way. I guess that's how it was with Duke, too. Don't worry. I'll come up with something. Or my name isn't Rita Mordio. I won't let Estelle wind up trapped like that again. Nobody treats my spirit. friend like just some thing. Okay, I'll leave you to it. Nothing to worry about. You've got the best genius under the sun with you. Yes, I know Rita can help me. I'll have this ready by tomorrow. You get yourself to bed. Okay, okay. All right, I think that's Don't everybody that we spoke with hard. for this. Same to you, Estelle. Um, for those who are wondering when we're gonna take our break, um, it's gonna be right before we start the next dungeon, which is gonna be the final dungeon of Act 2. I want to start off on high spirits, like, when I come back. I don't want to, like, start off like, oh, I gotta talk to everybody in more cutscenes. I want to make sure that we are ready, we are primed, we are set, we are good to go. So that's gonna be the high spirits we're gonna ride on. So, for those who are expecting a break a little bit earlier, I apologize, but... I, I feel as though I, I need to do this to get myself in the right mindset. Hope everybody can get some sleep. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. I believe. Do you all believe? Because I believe. <laughs> Again, this is the only game that... Uh, you know what? I think the timeline was like when I started practicing this game, I was like, oh... I'll just save this game for last, because um, I only played it, I already played it a year ago, and I already did it during Marathon 1. Oh, there's nothing that could go wrong in terms of timing, and then I started going into it, and I'm like, oh no, this is a really long game. No, the next dungeon isn't bad. The boss is. That's a different story. That's certainly a different story. That's why I want to keep myself in high spirits for when we... Jump right into the dungeon. Keep myself in the right mindset. Oh yeah. Are you done trying to get Estelle back? I mean, she's still a princess. Oh yeah. What about all this? With the Imperial succession. Thank you, Yuri. That Yoder stuff. Their leader. And then there it is. <laughs> like it just gets resolved like that. I mean, it makes sense for Estelle. Hmm, okay. 
So that's why you don't need to chase her around anymore? That's not it. It's just that I finally come to terms with the choices she's made for herself. Wow, you sure loosened up. Don't give me a hard time. It's something I've had to struggle with in my own way. Well, she'd be happy to hear it. I'll bring the problems of the air and the Blastia to His Highness's attention. He'll be able to come up with some way of helping, I'm sure. As for Lady Estelise, Yuri, you have my confidence. All right, see you, Flynn. Sorry for being such a pain. We'll I'll leave you be, be then. See you at Zaude. We'll never see you again. Theranara, Shifa. As far as anyone is concerned, the capital was retaken because of my efforts. It isn't just with this, though. No one even knows the things you've... No. That brave Vesperi has done. They don't even try to learn the truth. Are you really okay with that? What? The song suddenly got louder and I can't quite hear you. So even Yuri couldn't hear you. Oh, hi, Yoder. Just eavesdropping everywhere, aren't you? Sneaky little guy. That's how he knows. That's why they chose him to be the the next king or whatever it is that he's supposed to be going for. I can believe. Imperial succession. Yeah, that's what it is. Uh, we gotta do a quick restock on items, I wanna say. Uh, yeah, I think we looking good. Feeling good. Uh, oh, maybe we gotta check on Estelle a bit when she comes back. Star Wars fans. Oh yeah, that's another thing I haven't watched. Someday I'll watch a Star Wars thing. Some, someday. Ain't today, though. Morning, Yuri. Yuri, you're such a sleepyhead. Oh, looks like I overslept a little. My hair is a mess. Is that all you're worried about? <laughs> I think I'm aware like of the Imperial good. March, though. Something like that. Some kind of song. Here you go. He pulled it off. Now we just need Judy and Estelle. Here I am. Good morning, everyone. Oh, what was she doing? She was going to talk with Pharaoh, right? If I recall correctly. Were you able to get in touch with Pharaoh? Yeah, there it is. Yes, but you won't like what he told me about Zauda. He says it's a place that must be left undisturbed by both Intelikea and humans. I wonder why. Such an encouraging send off. Oh, we'll know. We'll, well know soon like we enough. Just say, oh, thanks for telling us, and not go. Alexei's at Zaude. <laughs> Good one. And I'm really not in the mood to just let him go. We can't just turn back now. You're right. Pharaoh will have to understand. We already came this far. We can't stop now. Yes, Besides, I like this vigor. Let's ignore. keep this going. The whole world's gonna be in all kinds of trouble. That's the spirit. Now we just need Estelle. Rita, did you see her? Estelle won't be coming. Hmm? Well, so much for- she Well, I mean, we've been doing anymore. fine without her, like, healing-wise, so no there's no point for her to join us, I guess. The control was a success. But she needs to avoid air interference in order to keep her power from activating. Huh? But all Blastia need air to work, don't they? Yes. So I tried the same thing as Raven. You yeah, so that's, that's the interesting thing, where it's like- now, now it's like her Are own life force, similarly to how I Raven really has it. That. I like how they connected that that whole way. strand with like uh, Estelle's formulas without worrying uh, about power air. with what Raven just introduced in, not in that boss fight. the power of the child of the full moon. Even Arts will use her life. She could be in serious danger if she had to exert herself. Oh no! So she won't be coming with us anymore. And was she okay with that? And she has to keep herself within the barrier no. to protect herself. <laughs> ah, yeah, hey, so welcome you, back. You're just here to see us off, right? Rita, I'm sorry. Please take me with you. I don't think it's more so like an age thing, but more like an energy thing. What but I hear you. What did I tell you? You lose your life just by using your arts. You could go on living with no problem if you just wouldn't use them. I sat up all night thinking about what you told me. At first, I thought, finally, I'll be able to live a normal life. 
Yeah. You've so this would be the point where it'd be the end. See, honestly, know. like, if I didn't have to go overtime, Thank like, you, the length of this game, if you we ended it off, like, in the next dungeon, fight. that would be, like, the end of the Even game, the for sure. But they did add little hints and pieces of Antilochea. Like, that, real talk. Like, honestly, the end of Act 2 of this game would have been the end of any other, like, regular length Let's Tales go. game. But, um, it's, it's not going to be the I case, that's for sure. For my friends. So I'm asking you, please, take me with you. I want to tell you now, but you decided this for yourself. I won't turn you down. Yes, and she doesn't really listen when she sets her mind to something. Ain't that the truth. Well, let's take her. Nobody likes having their friends run off to steal all the fun. Yeah, we'll all help out to make this easy on her. We're gonna blow that Actually, a pretty good screenshot, like of the party members right here. I remember when I was trying to get, like, get those uh, Tales of Recollection stuff going thing. before the you anniversary. Never, never I tried to get like as many group shots as possible. Got it. I'll never forgive you. Uh, you this is just as long. Promise. It is long, but right. um, I want to say Definitive Edition cool. adds more to Vesperia that makes it even longer than Abyss. Pointless. I don't know. Actually, hmm. <laughs> what the, what it looks character? like I made it in time. <laughs> Leave the child alone. He's already gone through his character arc. Don't don't put him down a couple pegs. Prince Yoder and Flynn too? My, what an honor for his highness to see us off himself. There you go again with that attitude of yours. <laughs> you may have already heard, but the supply of like... has been delayed. <laughs> So the knights are not even I like the contrast. was like, Flynn was so complimentary, and I was like, oh, there you go again, Yuri. The knights should be the ones taking the initiative. Oh, no, Tales of Symphonia is definitely shorter. The have shouldered it. As head of the Empire, I must apologize. In the first marathon, I, I took a couple of minutes just voice acting stuff. Empire anyway. <laughs> like, like that's how much, like, flexible time I had when I did, when I went through the first marathon a couple years ago. in their place. Huh? Your Highness. And I think, like, I finished within the time Both frame, too. Nothing was added in Symphonia with a uh, Chronicles the release, so. Um, I mean, nothing was added to the main narrative in Chronicles I release. Sure that he will be of great use to you. I guess who's joining next? Yoda is joining us. Uh, he's gonna be a mage but type. I, oh, he doesn't just stand there and I he sneaks around. The as soon as the knights are ready, I will send them after you. You should be able to entrust your men with that much. Besides, are you not the one who desires most to settle things personally with Alexei? Your Highness. He sounds a little bit more. He 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 leans a little bit more towards Asbel here. I, Yoder, Argrios, Am I doing Eternia on PSP or PS1? On PSP. I wanted to do PS1, but then my Eternia discs were. <laughs> Flynn, Shifo. They, they were doing weird things. There's a point when I was doing a random battle. It's on my Twitter where uh, the game froze and Farah just said random stuff. Yes, that's what I'm going with PSP. You heard his highness. I'll be counting on you, Yuri. Even if I refused, you'd still come along, wouldn't you? So our next problem is just how to Yeah, no, I hear you, Dragstar. <laughs> I wish I was in your position where like it would have been a long time since I played through Symphonia, but that game always keeps coming back in my life for some reason. <laughs> where I end up still playing it, I'm like, oh man, I gotta get through a certain point. And it always involves the sewer dungeon. <laughs> I hate the sewer dungeon. It will never leave. It will never leave. Yep, we'll be able to use the Fiertia in no time. So everything and Omega ready. brings up a good point. This is it, the final battle. Wait, what the? What do my notes say? Oh, okay, okay, uh, just about winding down a little bit here, because I, I need to get some energy in me. Stat! Stat! I know we started a little bit late today, but, yeah, I really gotta get some energy in me soon, <laughs> right after all this stuff. 
It's so the final. Oh, thank you, Eclipse, for reminding me. I'm gonna check on the skills after this. It's sort of shaped like a ring. Anybody with fingers big enough for that wouldn't have any trouble taking over the world. There's no way Alexei could fit that on his finger. I wonder if we'll get in without being seen. Whoa, look! Over there! Pharaoh. This should really be the final battle, to be honest. Pharaoh's like, y'all are trying to not heed my word? <laughs> As you know, he's actually helping out, helping us out. By the power of brave Vesperia, shine down upon thee. Yo, Pharaoh, if Pharaoh had a fight, that would be his Mystic Art. No, that wouldn't be Mystic Guard because that's Zalde that's channeling the power of uh, Rave Vesperia. I think the point is EDM is that like if the story didn't involve anything with the Antelakea or the the fuel problem, then this would be the the end of the and game for a standard Tales game. It. What did we get ourselves into? It reconstituted itself by manipulating the air. What processing speed? <laughs> is that the power Alexei was after? <laughs> if Rita was in the real world, she would definitely be one of those people that Let's you'd see at like a below. computer computer build store. Like she she built a computer work, for you or something. At least he's got Alexei looking up for now. Pharaoh, thank you. She'd have the latest tech. She'd probably have like a 3090 RTX somewhere. She's probably got the 4K RTX sitting around somewhere. She only she's the one who builds them. She'll have her own company. Oh, I wish I was playing Rays. I wish I could close, play the collab. <laughs> I have all the AP for to grind it out to get like really uh full fully no equipped soul bad guy. But unfortunately, it's gotta I can't. be a Hopeland Blastia designed to threaten everyone in the world. It must possess unimaginable power. Hey, look! It's a ship. Is it the Knights? No, Flynn. I can't believe they'd make it here this fast. No, it's probably the Royal Guard. That must mean. Well, if you want to go after Patty Skin, that's up to you. But so bad guy, so bad guy. I mean, actually, yeah, yeah. You know what? Patty does come with the with the dolphin. Yep. <laughs> That's such a perfect casting. I, I can't I can't gush enough There's about so like the Guilty Gear series. crossover. It's so perfect. There aren't that many. Bonus stream. There are not going to be any, any bonus streams during this marathon. Unfortunately, there is no Easy. time to fit We're not anything. Here to get noticed. Let's see if there isn't some other way in. Okay. Uh, that other way in. Is not there because I'm going back to the ship. I mean, all the way over here. But hmm, you know what? Yeah, I should probably double check my skills first. Particularly, we need to check up on uh, Estelle here. Uh, Estelle, oops, she doesn't have any of these equipped. All shield based. Okay. Should have anything else that we need to change? Alright, uh, was Ruby One useful? Yeah, I already got it. I already got her as equipped for Ruby One. Kite Shield. Huh. Did I not get ki uh, Kite Shields on? Defend to resist to Magic Art Plus. I missed resist to. Oops. Uh, okay, let's fix that. Flynn! I don't think I need to fix up Flynn's skills, I think, because they're pretty much... I'm keeping them the same as um, uh, Backchain, because I don't think there's too much really to fix outside of uh, the smashes right over here. Uh, oops. And also... Natural Recover and Spell Area. Uh, where are we at? Uh, 
Granted, natural recovery don't really mean much if he's in battle anyway, so... It don't matter. Oh, and he still came back with a rebirth ring. How cute. Uh... Can we get that stuff from Kite Shield? No, we already did. How about, uh... Master Sh No, I just did that. Uh... Heater Shield. I think we got that, too. Yeah, we did. Okay. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Looks like we got that down, Pat. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Anything else we need to watch out for? I don't think so. Um, maybe play as Raven, Repeat, Carol, and Estelle. Yeah, that sounds good. Enough. We'll set it up for later. Um, is there anything else I need to do? I think we should save and. We'll finally get into our break period. I should have went into this 45 minutes ago, but we're, we're, we're getting there. So I'll see you guys in 30 minutes.